Ah? Ah? Please. Please tell me you hear me. I'm seeing audio in OBS. Please tell me you hear me now. I don't know what happened, but... You hear? You hear? They're just focusing on something outside the stream, I hear you now. I... I... The game was progressing. What do you mean I was focusing on something other than the stream? The game was progressing. I was... Do you think I just skipped dialogue like that? Now I have to restart, I think. I have to restart the game, because no way I'm... Fucking... No way I'm just gonna let that happen. No. Run. Just make a new game. I don't know for how long the audio has been out for. Has it been like that the whole time? Wait. Okay. I... Seems like it... Seems like it's still good. I hope. So, uh, one of the things I was saying is that ever since yesterday, like, ever since I came back to England, my throat's been fucking killing me. So this is not a good start at all. Uh. And also, I can't find my controller. Uh, that was another thing. That I was, uh, that I was saying, and I don't really know, uh, if the stream picked up on it. It's here. Let me see if it's here. No. Uh, also, my doctor spell. Well, oh, great. That's amazing. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. Let's. It's all good. It's all good. I'll just use keyboard and we'll be fine. All right. Let's pretend that never happened. Those, uh, how long has it been? 21 minutes. Those 21 minutes never happened. All right. Hope you have enough tea and halls to keep your throat alive. Honestly, my, well, actually, yeah, my mom gave me, uh, like 50 bags of tea just to, uh, like, just to, um it wasn't for the sore throat i don't think i ever even told her that i have a sore throat um but i do have tea here right now <sighs> how's the trip it was good i have to I, now i have to just keep checking the the mic trip was good well Honestly, it could have been better because one of my dogs got a tumor, which I'm not happy about. I'm really stressed out about that. Uh, I also got a hernia, and I had to get, <laughs> I had to get surgery for that. Um, so now I also just don't have a belly button anymore. But yeah, who needs it? Who needs that? Um. And and also my mom got scammed, but honestly, I'm not even surprised to hear that. Um. Anyway, back to the game. The first item in the to-do list is always the hardest one to cross off. If we could just get one item done, the rest would surely follow. We just need to start. That's why some people find find the easiest item first and start from there. It gives them a better chance at getting something done. But yeah, mostly I've just been, like, most of my trip has been me either watching anime or reading manga. <laughs> That's what you go to Italy for. Well, actually, the manga reading is, like, I, I actually managed to find more manga there than I do here, so. <laughs> I mean, I got to read the entirety of Black Cat just because I found it in, uh, in, like, a retro manga store. This is because setting things in motion is difficult. Choosing to do homework is difficult. Choosing to clean your room is difficult. Choosing to get out of bed is difficult. Change is uncomfortable. It's always easier to leave things the way they are. To let the flow carry you. That sounds nice. Yeah, that's pretty much been the whole trip. <laughs> Until you reach a point where doing nothing does more damage than doing anything. 
I should watch Black Cat on stream because I have the manga fresh in my head, but I I've never watched the anime, so I should get to that at some point. Hey Sai, how you doing? When this happens, change is no longer a choice; it's a consequence. Is that also a choice? The choice to do nothing? I told you to do actual streams, not hamster streams, man. Well, I'm here. Honestly, the thing is, I couldn't do that is the problem. I was in Italy. It's a it's a miracle I could stream at all. Like, it's a miracle I could, I could even start a stream. I was in Italy the entire time. Like, I could not stream myself, you know? Like, I would have streamed more often if I could have, but I couldn't, so. For now, I'll focus on getting the first item on the list done. All I need to do is choose coffee. And also macarons. Coffee and macarons. Coffee and macarons. A coffee and macarons. Those were the items I picked in the demo, and those are the items I vibe with the most. I wouldn't have streamed, I would have took that as an excuse to not stream until I got back. Yeah, that's what I did. That's why Furret took over the whole time. It's been two months since Michael's, <laughs> since Michael's anniversary, and I still remember the chaos caused during the Goose Goose Duck. Oh my god. I remember that. <laughs> yeah. That was fun. I got... I... <laughs> My luck was pristine. Yeah, I should, uh, I should clip that, but also not. I don't really feel like it. Okay, I got this. A coffee and macarons. I have to read all of this again. Could I get? Oh, hello. What the? This girl startled the soul out of me. Her whole vibe is really unsettling. She's cute as fuck, though. <laughs> Let's get this over with quickly. Um, hello. Could I... What can I get you? A coffee and macarons? Macarons? What kind? How many? Uh, the pink ones. That can be strawberry or raspberry or cotton candy. Maybe one of each? The minimum is six. Okay. So two of each. Two of each, yes. And a coffee. What kind of coffee? Just coffee? Black? Latte? With milk? Okay, Mike is still good. I, I have to check that every few minutes now. <laughs> I'm too paranoid. With whipped cream? Also, what size? Um, actually, just a bottle of water, please. A water and six macarons? Yes. All right. Have a seat. I'll bring it for you. Also, if you showed up constantly, I'll be worried about your health. Um, I mean, you probably should be. <laughs> As I don't think I'm going to be taking that good of a care of myself. That was embarrassing. I scared the cashier and I couldn't even get what I wanted. I can't even do this much. What is it? Do you notice that girl too? Is it just me or does she seem strange to you? I was just about to say the same thing. She gives off creepy, creepy vibes. This again. Just ignore them. Do you want to move? I'd feel impolite switching tables now, but yeah, let's go. Go, go before she curses us or something. Lacey, relax. It's just two girls. You can put up with it. That girl, isn't she the daughter of the family who lives in the next block? Oh my goodness, you're right. Man, just being around her gives me the chills. What is it about her, I wonder? Whatever, she's a freak. 
Mommy, can we leave? That lady... Shh. Don't look in her direction. Finish your food and we'll go. I don't want it anymore. I want to go. This is why I hate kids. Everyone wear condoms when you fuck. I've met her brother, though. He was in one of my classes. She's nothing like him. Ami, she's scary. I pity the poor people who have to share a classroom with her. Imagine what her family must feel having a daughter with such a reputation. Oh man, after what happened. Sucks of a broken family. They don't deserve that. It's probably her fault, don't you think? Uh, I couldn't even get what I paid for. <sighs> that was terrible. I knew it was a bad idea to go out. At least that's out of the way. I need to lie down for a minute. Looks like we got a visitor, though. Um, paranoid when I record. Remember the last time I recorded 10 hours of content when I was ready to edit? There was no sound at all. There was no sound at all. Turns out I was muted the whole time. Even- Oh, shit! There was- Wait, do it again. Uh... Even though an OBS, the volume thing was moving like there was sound. She has like a little animation, uh, like a little idle, idle animation, that's cool. A crow keeps watch in front of your house. Maybe it's waiting for some food? I brought the bird food with me. I just have to fill up the feeder. A birdhouse. We don't get many birds, but I leave food here for them in case, just in case. I'd rather go inside right now. Yeah, I mean, I remember how in one of the streams, uh, in one of these uh, streams, I played Angels of Death and like, the game was muted the whole time because I was watching One Piece before it. And I literally spent the whole of today putting audio into that VOD. And I'm almost done, so I'm gonna release it either tomorrow or sometime this week. Or, wait. Oh, it's Monday, yeah. So, sometime this week. Um, but, like... Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm still mad about that, by the way. That, that was annoying. I should have just restarted the whole game. <laughs> the whole episode 4. The garage door. It requires a remote a, a remote control to open from the outside. Yes, I know. A shoe rack full of shoes of various colors. A pink plant. An umbrella basket. It, it often gets kicked around by accident. Slippers to change into. Oh! I did not know about this. Some pictures of places around the world. I'm surprised she didn't just interact with the slippers. Mom and father... Oh, mother and father go on trips a lot. I don't even know where they are right now. Some decorative plates. A painting of a sleeping cat. Drawers are filled with miscellaneous. <laughs> uh, I blame my throat for this. <sighs> and I'm out of tea, so I need to go make some. Drawers filled with miscellaneous items, unfit for a kitchen. A landline phone. Dial a number? Sure. Oops. 
Uh, sure. Yeah, I'm surprised it didn't just. <laughs> A tall green plant. I'm debating if I should. That's not much of a change. Huh. A large cupboard. There's nothing inside. A bowl full of, full of fresh fruit. Also, I forgot to record. Fuck. Again, I forgot to record. Checking the contents of the fridge calms you down. I'm debating if I should voice over it or just restart. Honestly, restarting wouldn't hurt me. Um... I guess restart. I don't know. Checking the contents of the fridge calms you down. Do you want to have the leftovers mother left for you? Sure. Right, that was on the to-do list too. For a last meal, it kind of sucked. <laughs> A note from your mother. Read it. Your dad and I will be back on Monday. It is Monday for me. <laughs> There's food in the fridge. Make sure to heat it up. Call us at... Right, I remember this was optional, but I want to do it anyway. So let me just... Okay. Call us at this number if there's any problems. Mom. <laughs> A trash can can uh, a trash can with nothing but the memory of bad kitchen smells. The microwave emanates an aura of familiarity. A toaster. Nothing of interest. They're quite literally nothing. A very clean sink. Turn on the tap. Just leave it like that. Turn off the tap? No, I'm keeping it like that. A rice cooker. Various kitchen tools. The uh, various kitchen tools are stored in the drawers underneath. The oven. You hardly ever use it. Cutlery is stored in this drawer. All right, that should be everything. Can I reopen the fridge? Nothing new has materialized since the last time you checked. Tonight? No. Go back. An umbrella basket. There was a discount for buying two of them. Large pile of boxes. An empty bucket, not a trash can. Some boxes that may or may not be empty. Also, that's the... That's the same curtain... That's the same curtain as uh, the one in Project Cat. It's the same asset. Large cupboard. There's quite a bit of space inside. A shelf unit filled with various tools, paint, and old manuals. It's the same. It's the same. It's the same. Alright. Okay. Turn this on. An old lamp. It's not plugged in. Never mind. Don't turn it on. There's nothing of use here. Some boxes containing holiday decorations. The garage door leads outside. It opens with a remote control. My parents probably took it in the car with them. Oh, I can't check the papers. An empty trash can, not a bucket. Uh. Uh, anyway, let's see the optional dialogue real quick. Let me just... Uh, dial a number, yes. So it was one, nine, five, two, two, four, ash, one. Hi, hi. Who's it? Who's this? Hello, mom. Ah, Lacey, what is it? I was just calling to check on you. 
We're very busy. Do you need anything? No. Then I'll call you some other time. Okay. What a bitch. Call her again. I don't remember if that did anything. Hold on. One, nine. That was wrong. One, nine, five, two, two, four, ash one. They're not picking up. What a bitch. A painting of a sleeping cat. Okay. Um, a large cupboard that could fit a person. A box in the plant sits on top of the cupboard. A bookshop with random decorative books. There's also a few neatly aligned office supplies. Tall plant. It's locked. This is the laundry room. I'll never understand why doors around the house need to be locked. Maybe here has the key? But I don't need anything from here. Assorted bathroom supply. <laughs> supplies. Your reflection stares back at you. Various toiletries are stored around here. A trash can. Empty as it should be. Like my brain. Whee! Quality gameplay. Properly stocked toilet paper. What the fuck? I thought I just saw a light like on the corner of my eye. I, I'm going blind. Okay, some books on gardening, some more books on gardening, apparently. The family dining table, we don't hear, he uh, <laughs> we don't eat here as much anymore. You can see the neighbor's house from here. Let's try to avoid eye contact with them if possible. The family dining table. I've been outside enough for now. Poor girl. A coffee table. The plants get in the way sometimes. Just sitting down, just enjoying life. You can see the neighbor's house from here. A pretty plant. A TV. A TV. No, that that's that's not a TV. That's like that like from from here on you're not looking at the TV, but okay. Wait, uh, on. A shelf containing mainly glassware. It would definitely hurt if this fell on top of somebody. Actually, I wanna, like, oh. Yeah, you can't see it if the lights are on, but, yeah. I think I'll go straight to my room. Lacey! Hero! You scared me. What? Did you go out? I did, just for a little bit. Seriously? Yeah, I grabbed... Ah, you went outside? Into the world? That's incredible, I'm so proud! A week ago you weren't even opening the front door! She finally went outside! The tides are shifting. History is being made. Next, you'll be going to the market. Then, back to school. You'll make so many friends. It's gonna be amazing. I really think you're exaggerating. No way. You've been cooped up for so long. It hasn't been that long. 
Now that you've mastered that, we can go for an ice cream. Together. No way. It didn't actually go that well today. I messed up my order and I left really fast. Then I'll order for you. I'll do it until you can order on your own. It will get better. It won't, unless I fix the root cause of the problem. You mean, you're still doing the ritual? Yes. I see. Well, I won't object anymore. Just be wise. I'll be outside if you need me. Ah. It's a painting similar to the one downstairs. It's a painting identical to the one on the right. Uh, they don't. Oh, yeah, that that one. <laughs> the painting identical to the one on the left. A plant. Identical to the one downstairs. Some old family pictures. It's a decoration of some sort. You really don't know. A pretty plan. The buds are not edible. It's locked. No, not that. Hero's room. I'd rather not go in without permission. Oh, that's the bathroom. Okay, I thought I just went into my room. Thankfully, there's plenty of toilet paper. Quality gameplay. Anyway. A towel. A drawer contains various toiletries. Nothing but air fills this trash can. Some towels in the laundry basket. Hey Sai, how you doing? Some towels in the laundry basket. The drawer contains a hair dryer and other, other appliances. It's just you. It's just me, myself, and I. Relax- uh, A relaxing bathtub. A stool. Soap, shampoo, conditioner. Even in the bathroom, there are plants. This one is fake, though. Oh. Oh, nice. No! I wanted to go talk to Hero. Why am I so goddamn curious? Ah, uh, finally. Uh, why is life on such a high difficulty setting? Maybe I'll just nap this day away. No, 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 no. What am I saying? I have things to do. Especially after today's today's experience. It's good that there's no other way to move forward. <sighs> Alright, let's not waste time. This letter is the real deal, isn't it? Just holding it makes me nervous. Ritual letter. I still can't believe it actually arrived. On the forums, some people waited for months and it never came. But for me, it only took a day. This isn't my first ritual, but... It's my first time getting intentionally spirited away. Anyways, I need to tie a red thing to the phone, paint some symbols at the front door, then go to sleep. Sounds simple enough. For the phone, I could use a ribbon or a thread or anything similar that's red. For the front door, a marker? Or do I need to use real paint? And I need to finish it all before the sun sets. Maybe it won't be that simple after all. Alright. Leftover orange juice. It's too warm to drink now. A book on the occult. Read a passage? Sure. Salt is important when dealing with demons. For best result... A handful must be thrown at the target. That's... 
So that's where she read it from. It, it'll come back, I remember. An overflowing ca trash can. Since you're the one who filled it up, there's no point in emptying it. There's no time for games right now. The TV is solely used to dock the game console. Is that yeah, that's a that's a switch. <laughs> oh. Some clothes I got as a gift. It's not the time to open them yet. Change into Oh right, right, right. Wait, that that's the outfit I was already wearing. Um change into indoor clothes. Ah, it feels nice to change into lighter clothes. Sadly, I can't stay like this. It makes me feel lazy and I have things to do. I should take all of this with me. Oh. My notebook to organize my thoughts. A rune. The rune for the ritual. Salt for self-defense. Obtained return doorknob. I don't remember that. And finally this thing. If the information I got is accurate, then this is my ticket back home. You place the letter and to-do list into the notebook. Oh. Your Tama Ghost, TM. You feed your cop your Tama Ghost. Oh, <laughs> That was one of the things to do. I didn't even know. Lacey's diary. I don't feel like going through it right now. It's nice outside. But not nice enough to want to go back out. A happy little green plant. It doesn't need a lot of watering, thankfully. An umbrella. A calendar. It's still stuck in March 6th. Months ago. That's... That was only five days ago. <laughs> March 6th. That's only five days ago. Oh well. Is there even a point in turning the pages? The year is more or less over anyways. That's fair. Wait, what's this? Various bows and hair decorations. There's some red ribbon here. Take the red ribbon? Oh. I never would have noticed. I think I got it from somewhere else last time. My bed. My digital alarm clock. I'm so used to pushing snooze on this thing. I hope I don't do it again out of reflex and ruin the ritual. Set it for midnight? Sure. It's done. Some cute posters. A bookshelf with school related books. Manga and other non-academic stuff gets to go in the bottom compartment. Blue, pink, looks like I don't have any red markers. Maybe in my parents room? My computer, it's always on. Same, same with mine, except <laughs> for the wrong reason. Set up the computer, not yet. Um. The mugs pile up here. The drawers contain school papers. The best plan in this house. A cozy gaming space by the window. Aw. No, go back. I don't wanna- no. No, go- go- go back. Okay. I made some tea, but it's too bitter. I use four green tea bags and four vitam vitam. What the fuck is that in tea? I boiled them all in the same pot on the stove and forgot about it. I just put it in a cup, so it's bit. put it in a cup. It's so bitter. I boiled it for way too long. Oh. Oh. That's nice. 
Um, no reading space would be complete without decorative books. No, that's that's a fucking chair. Winter vacation photos. You're not in any of them. Poor girl. It's locked. You shouldn't go in. What about here? Oh. This is the parents' rooms. What the fuck was the locked one? The wardrobe. It doesn't even cl close well anymore. Open it? Sure. There's a few clothes inside. The wardrobe. It doesn't close. That's not... I I'm talking to the goddamn lamp. A sewing kit. My parents' bed. They have fucked on this bed. As... And... As Lele would say. A classic alarm clock. Father doesn't trust the alarm app. Honestly, that alarm app has failed to wake me up multiple times. And by multiple times, I mean pretty much every time I use it. <laughs> And I don't think that's the alarm map. I think that's just me. <laughs> I sleep way too much. You can see the neighbor's house from here. A shelf with nothing of interest. Shelf with nothing of interest. Shelf with nothing of interest. A plan. We have several like this one. A computer ch A computer chair. Yours is better. A bookshelf of complicated books. Black, black, no red markers here. Maybe downstairs? Vitamin tea, ah. Tea for people who don't eat enough vitamins or nutritious food. The old fashioned alarm will wake me up first time. My phone, it takes up takes 8 to 12 alarms for me to wake up and they have to be back to back uh laundry room it's locked uh right can i talk to yeah okay ah it's hero i wonder what he's reading Probably shouldn't bother him. He's always so nice to me, but I'm sure he needs a break sometimes. I have a stalker. Uh, no, I was just passing through. Sit, sit. Um, okay. Listen to this. One for sorrow, two for mirth. Three for a funeral, four for birth. Five for heaven, six for hell. Seven for the devil. His own self. Spooky, huh? Do you know what it is? A poem? Yeah, about counting magpies. They're kind of like crows, but cuter. Huh? Supposedly, the number of mag magpies that you see determines your fate. But there's so many variations to the rhyme. How can you properly predict your fate? I'm not sure I believe in fate. It can be nice to believe in something. Hmm, I believe in... Macarons. I thought you would say something like that. I believe in... Lacey. I believe you can achieve your dreams. Then, I'll try to believe too. Don't hesitate to talk to me if you want. Oh, don't mind if I do. You never bother me, okay? Okay. Hero, you're too cheesy. But thanks. What is that book, anyway? Legends and nursery rhymes. That sort of things. Thing. I got it at the books. I got it at the bookstore down the street. Is it any good? Sure. You might enjoy them. They're not all that creepy. There's a legend that says the heart of the witch can grant any wish. Hmm. 
Sounds like there must be a catch. Maybe. I haven't finished it yet. You don't usually read fiction. Ah, guilty. I'm too impatient with long stories. I like skipping to the end to see what happens. Doesn't that spoil the fun? Well, Lace, you might like solving puzzles and mystery... <laughs> solving puzzles and mysteries before they get revealed. But I like it when the answers are served neatly on the platter. With extra cheese. Yes, I'm aware of the cheese. How's Ritual going? It's going. Are you nervous? Do you think it'll work? Kind of. If it worked, it wouldn't be the strangest thing that's happened to me. You're right about that. Oh hey, remember. Mother left some food in the fridge. Don't need it cold though. You always eat things cold. See? That's why you're so small. You don't get proper nutrition. First, I already ate it. Second, I'm not small. You're tiny. Be safe out there, Lace. And put your safety first before anything else. Hmm, you've said this 30 times already. Only 30? <laughs> Hero seems focused on his book. You can't seem to say goodbye to him. Right, we never do get to say goodbye to him. Another nice plant. A nice table. A nice chair. A nice chair. Potted plant. This one is called Jacques. What about this one? Potted plant. This one is called Lucardo. Sounds like a Jojo character. Araki, get on that. A tree. A tree. A pond surrounded by flowers. I did not even notice that was water. I wish we had frogs here. Some pretty flowers are lined up on the sides. Lamps that look a lot nicer. At night. Okay. A bush. Named George. A tree. A tree. Some pretty flowers lined up on the side. A birdhouse. I need to get the bird food, wherever that was. The front door. I need to paint a red symbol here. Go inside? Yes. Um, I think there was something in here, right? Drawers are filled with miscellaneous items unfit for a kitchen. Never mind? I thought there was. The cutlery stored in the straw. Nothing new has materialized. The sink is still on. <laughs> I'll leave it on for the rest of the game. A rice cooker. Various kitchen tools are stored in the jars underneath. Fuck my throat. A toaster. Nothing of interest. There's a can of red paint here. Take the red paint, perfect. Uh, a shelf unit filled with various tools, paint, and old manuals. A large cupboard, there's quite a bit of space inside. Okay. Well, while we're at it, puh, at it. While we're at it, we might as well just paint the door. There's no red symbol painted on it. Go inside. No. Uh, inventory. Oh, I do have the bird food. Shit. Time to draw. What a strange symbol. Now. Now the house will be even more cursed than it already was. Yep. Alright. Uh, let's feed the bird. You filled up the bird bird food ball inside cool a 
a birdhouse. So, the last one is say goodbye to Hero. Can I do that? Hero seems focused on his book. Can't seem to say goodbye to him. Damn. So we never do get to say goodbye to him. So, um, objectives. Prepare the ritual. Tie a string on the phone cord. Okay. Is a bunny rabbit not fine? Talk to Hero. I need to tell Hero to leave the house. I finished setting up the ritual. I see. Um... Is there really nothing I can do to make you change your mind about doing this ritual? Hero. I know, I know. I know I said I'd stop, but... I'm just worried. I'll be fine, and I'll see you tomorrow. Alright. So, I wanted to ask again. Just in case, you wouldn't mind not being in the house tonight. Understood. I don't think any bit. I don't think anything bad would happen, but just in case. Oh, my throat. It hurts. Remember to say before you start the ritual, just in case you need to go back. Hmm. Yeah, you're right about that. I should probably do that. Got it. Don't worry. I made some plans, so I'll be out late tonight. Okay. Just don't be here before it's 12.30. Don't worry. Yeah, don't worry so much. 12.31 on the dot. Really, though, take care of yourself. Make sure you get back... You get back in one piece. Great anime. I mean it, be safe. I need to go make tea. Okay. Ah, it figures. I can't say goodbye to him properly after that. Oh well. Why did I have to say I'll see him tomorrow? Objectives. Get in bed. Apparently I need to lie in bed until the alarm goes off. First, we save. Wait, can I change into the casual fit? Indoor clothes. There's no point in changing right now. Then why the fuck did you change in the first place? <laughs> Wait. Okay, let me go make tea. Just <laughs> real quick. I'm gonna boil the kettle. Ugh. And my foot is numb. Amazing. Oh god. Walking is difficult. Tea bag. Right. While the kettle is boiling, let's let's just go to bed. My bed. Go to sleep. Yes. I'm too nervous to do anything else, anyways. Then again, I'm not sure I can actually fall asleep. I'll just lie down and close my eyes. Oh, kettle. On. This place. I get on. The kettle finished boiling. Let me go make my tea.
Okay. This place, again. I guess I really did fall asleep. Damn it, Mim! Sometimes I wake up here after falling asleep. I have to stream a lot. But it seems I can't leave until I see it through to the end. Um, I can't save. Well, here we go. Wait, no. Once I cross this area, this stream will be over. I want to explore, but all right. In fact, you know what? Yeah, let's do that. I want to explore. I just saved, so this should be fine. Uh, I started setting my clothes a couple hours ago. Oh! Oh! Wow! Just does not let you reset. Oh, I remember in the demo you could... You could, uh... Oh, I guess maybe it's later on? This door doesn't open. Oh, okay. So I guess I only had one choice. A bed. It's similar to... not. To mine, but it's always cold. Huh. Okay. Guess I can't actually explore. Well, here we go. Once I cross this area, this stream will be over. Welcome back, Lacey. We've missed you at school. You have a lot to catch up on, so your classmates organized the reading material for you. You can find it in your locker. Please be sure to look over everything carefully. You wouldn't want to fail the year. <sighs> Blindingly white light is all you can see. Students laughing at you. I hate them. Students laughing at you. I just need to open my locker and then the closet to end this. My locker is that one. <laughs> it's pretty obvious, isn't it? This isn't your locker. Oh! What? Well, shit. Well, goddamn. I was not expecting that at all. Um. Fun. This isn't your locker. This isn't your locker. Okay. It's the exit. Doesn't open until I check the locker. Huh. Trash fills your locker. What a mess. What the fuck are people sending me? Alright, hold on. Alright, I'll be back with tea. Just a sec.
I'm back in black. I hit the sack. I've been too long. I'm glad to be back. Back to referencing that again. Just imagine someone built to play football wearing a crop top and shorts. Just glad I was so full of myself. Even if they were trying to bully me, I didn't realize. Wait. I started sorting my clothes a couple hours ago. Uh, and I just made it to my high school slash middle school box. And I realized why people thought I was gay. Most of the box is camo shorts. There's camo short shorts and crop tops. Just imagine someone built to play football wearing a crop top and shorts. Just glad I was so full of myself. They were trying to bully me. I realized that. Wait. Uh, full of myself. Even if they were trying to bully me, I didn't realize it. Thank God for that. I was almost 100% sure that was enough to dress code, but they allowed it anyway. I mean, what are they going to do? Take it off? <laughs> Fun. Why am I getting fucking images, like, on my phone? Alright, I'm so sick of the stream. It's time, right? Also, okay. I'm still checking the mic. I'm so paranoid. Fuck is sending me memes. It's time, right? Anyways, once I'm ready to go, I just need to call that number. What number? Call the bus. The phone number I should dial is actually. I don't think about it. I'm an idiot because I could just. To do list, which I already done, except for say goodbye to hero, which I wasn't able to. Ritual letter. It's the bus ritual instructions. It details how to summon. A bus which picks you up at night. Read the full ritual notes? Sure. You must play alone. Requirements. An indoor location. A landline phone. A red thread. Red paint. A rune. A clock. Preparations. Complete the preparations before the sun has set. Tie a red thread to the phone cord. Using the red paint, draw the following symbol on the exit door of your chosen location. The door must lead outside. Set the alarm clock to midnight. Instructions, go to sleep. When the alarm clock rings, get up and dial the following number on the phone. 999281-0, which I need to take a picture of. Because I'm never going to remember that. When the line connects, say the following words. My bus is late. Board the bus before it leaves. Place a rune inside the bus ticket machine. Remember, do not bring any weapons with you. The phone may no longer look the same at night. Remember the placement of the numbers. Oh, thank you. There's the alarm clock. My bad. My computer and chair. Oh, I should have gone on my computer. Fuck, I forgot to do that. That should be correct? Yeah, I think so. So, oh. It's locked. Hold on, go to the bathroom, because I think if you look in the mirror... It's just you. Is it though? How can we know? No? Nothing? Nothing yet.
I think uh, if I look out the window, there was something. You can see the neighbor's house from here. There seems to be someone staring at you from the other house. Oh. Well, hey there. You can see the neighbor's house from here. Okay. So now I have to very clean sink. No, the tap stays on the whole game. A landline phone. A red string can be seen hanging from its cord. Dial a number? Yes. Right. I forgot about that. So this is nine. Uh, two. Eight. One. This is the hashtag, right? And zero. You hear some strange noises on the other side of the line. What will you say? Where is my bus? I need a bus. My bus is late. Don't say anything. The correct thing is my bus is late. But I also want to see what happens if I say, where is my bus? Take the bus? <gasps> Wait, that's going to be a bad ending, isn't it? I think in the demo, this ending wasn't present, but... Try all the wrong options first, yeah. The bus is not there. Did it already leave? Or did it never come? Does this mean the ritual is no good either? This is bad. In any case... This ritual is a bust. I need to clean up now. The consequences for leaving things mid-ritual can be pretty dire. Or so I read. I left the instructions... I left the instructions to undo the ritual at the PC. Wait, what? Hold on, the game continues? Hold the fuck... Wait, hold on a minute. I just realized on the table there's something written. Something is written here. When was the last time you ate here? Have you forgotten? Computer and chair. The wardrobe... It doesn't close well anymore. Something is written on the door. The wardrobe is stuffy, isn't it? You almost can't breathe in there. You almost stopped breathing. Take a deep breath, Lacey. Open it. A cold breeze blows from the inside. That's freaky. Shouldn't go in. Oh. That wasn't there before. I checked this door. Something is written on the door. What is this room? You spent a lot of time in there. Always finding new places to hide away from the world? Did you ever stop hiding? Oh. Oh, hi. What? I really shouldn't look in the mirror at night, should I? It's just you. Is it? As I thought, the internet is not working. Thankfully, I saved that post as a PDF. 
What to do if you mess up a bus ritual? Spiky Trap 2 one year ago. I was about to do the bus ritual and saw that there are no clues about what to do if the bus doesn't come or something. Someone here said that leaving the ritual half done can be really bad. So I'm just asking to be safe. I don't guarantee this will work, but I haven't personally tried the bus ritual. Oh wait, I don't guarantee this will work as I haven't pers as I personally uh, haven't personally tried the bus ritual. Fucking words, I hate them. But my family works at a shrine, so I have some experience with banishing spirits. The step should be untie the red string or thread or whatever you use from the phone. Take a whole bunch of salt, any salt, and pour it in front of any exit of your home indoors. Make sure to pour salt on every exit. Windows are necessary, though. That's all. Hope this helps. Thanks. User marked this thread as solved. In other words, remove the red string from the phone and scatter salt in front of the front door, the back door, and the garage door. It sounds a little weak for a ritual, but it's better than nothing. Yeah, this is already new. I've never done this. It's just you. What if I go to the bathroom downstairs? I think it's here. That's the kitchen. Uh, bathroom. That's laundry room. There we go. Your reflection stares back at you. Something else will stare back at me. Come on. Um, I guess you're getting multiple endings today. Hope you save before you started all this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I made sure to save before talking to the phone. Uh, the front gate. The bus isn't here, so let's just clean up. Uh, salt? Table salt. Why can't... Can I... Or does it have to be like... Okay, that's how. You scattered salt on the entrance. Also, what was the objective again? Uh, add salt to the front door, untie the red string, add salt to the back door and garage door. Okay. A landline phone. Remove the red string? Yes. That's the bathroom again. That's the laundry room again. I am... Bad with directions in my own house. You scattered the salt on the entrance. You can see the neighbor's house from here. Is there not a figure watching me? No? Okay. And the garage door, which is here. No. Yes. Yes, it is. Also. A note from someone. Read it. Ritual. What you'll need. Candles, a knife, a chunk of meat, a hiding place, an accomplice, a victim. Wait, was that really how it went? Deeds outside. Okay. You scattered salt on the entrance. Objectives updated. Go to sleep. The ritual reversal is complete. There's nothing left to do other than get to bed. Okay. Wait a minute, this was not... A painting of... Huh? Wasn't this cat sleeping? No? Nothing? Wait... What is it? it doesn't seem to be working. Hope there's an ending where your brother's involved. Uh, maybe. I don't think so, because in the actual ending, or in the actual route, we, uh, a painting. A painting. A painting. In the actual, 
route we go to like a different world. All right, gotta go right. All right, have a have a good day, Sol. Oh wait, the lamp works. Huh. It's too dark to see right now. My bad. I hope the reversal works. I don't think it does. This was not in the demo, I don't think. Because I do recall in the demo, if you pick the wrong option and then leave the house, it just has a text saying, oh yeah, this ending is not available yet or something like that. Please work. Please work. Please work. Jump scare. I feel like I'm hearing things. Oh! Hero? Well, you got your wish. <laughs> Dead end one of two. Salt is for cooking. <laughs> Reached the wrong ending already. Oh, yes, okay. Um, wait a minute. Uh, let me just look something real quick. Look at something real quick. Um, I think the next dead ending is probably during one of the dream sequences. Uh... Mm. Okay. Does the other wrong answer give you a different ending or the same ending? That's what I'm trying to figure out. I think it gives the same ending though. But I mean, I might as well try. Uh, what was it? 999 You hear some strange noises on the other side of the line. What will you say? What if I don't say anything? Because I feel like saying the wrong thing might lead to the same ending. But not saying anything could potentially lead to something different. Okay. In any case, this first was a bust. Painting of? Wasn't this cat sleeping? It was until it wasn't. What if. Shouldn't go in. Wait. What if I. Uh. Which one was the bathroom again? This, right? No, that's the kitchen. God damn it. This is the bathroom. Okay. Yeah, okay. Huh. Cool. Also, why are these footsteps leading outside? Footprints leading, leading outside. They don't look like normal feet. Oh, I forgot to interact with them, apparently. Another nice plant. Hey, please. Okay. Let's just do this quickly. Uh, 
Uh, here. Uh, okay, so I'm with the right string, then salt. Can I take a knife from the cupboard? Rice cooker, various kitchen tools, cutlery. No, okay. Because I'm curious if you could maybe take a weapon, which would also break the rules of the ritual. I did not mean to go outside. Okay, and now I go to bed. I don't think this is... That's different. Okay, maybe it is leading to something different. I don't think it is, though. Please work, please work, please work. Yeah, it's the same ending. I feel like I'm hearing things. Yeah, okay. Hero? Yeah, okay. Same ending. Salt is for cooking. Alright. Alright. Let's say the right thing now. Dial a number. 999 and hashtag zero. You hear some strange noises on the other side of the line. What will you say? My bus is late. Already there. Get to the bus before the time runs out. But I kind of want cutlery stored neatly in the drawer, rice cooker, various kitchen tools. There. I kind of want to let the timer run out though. But that also might... Zero. Okay. Bus is not there, they're already leave or... Never come. Fuck. Because I think once you... Uh, wait, no, this might... Yeah, this is the same, isn't it? Okay, well... I should reset, but just in case. Just in case it's leading to something different. Is there a way to skip the dialogue? Like, like without spamming. Uh. Um. Okay, well. Uh, 
Okay. And now we get a bed. And probably get the same ending because. Uh, I mean, I would have put a different ending here, not gonna lie. I feel like I'm hearing things. Okay, yeah. Uh... I would have liked a different ending. Oh well. Alright, let's get this damn bus. Dial a number. 999 9, 9, 2 8 1 0. Alright. You say, my bus is late. Already there. Can I? Oh, I can't open the menu. Okay. Yeah, once you leave the house, the timer runs out. So it doesn't actually let you, like... Like, the timer stops. So it, it doesn't let you be late wire you're outside that was one thing i had at the back of my head how did we get here so fast i don't know but you're saving uh please there we go the front gate get on the bus yes i'll be back soon maybe once i get in there will be no turning back. I'll just drop the rune in this box. Looks like there's no one here. This spot is good. And so, we're off to who knows where. What would my parents think right now? Their daughter is on a bus headed straight towards certain death. It's hard to say this, but they would be happier without me. Even if I die on this trip, life will be better for them and Hero. Doing this ritual was the right choice. Whether I make it or fail, whether the Lacey everyone knows disappear, or a different Lacey makes it home, everyone wins. Poor Lacey. In my mind, I went through everything I knew about this ri- wait. In my mind, I went through everything I knew about this ritual. Then I remembered the words from a forum post. You must get off the bus before the end of the line. The letter said that the bus would simply take me to my destination, but that person was very insistent on not letting that happen. Seriously, you have to get off no matter what. The user that posted it has a big reputation in that forum, so their words probably have some merit to them. But won't I be breaking the rules if I do that? Also, what if the bus never stops? I can't just jump out the window, right? As I played with my thoughts, my consciousness started to fade away, and soon I was fully asleep. Uh, oh, okay. What? Again? 
This is ridiculous. I was just here a few minutes ago. I need to get this over with quickly so I can get off the bus. Oh? Huh? These stairs weren't here before. But I don't think there's any- there's anywhere to go out there. It's all blackness as far as I can see. I don't have time for this anyways. I need to wake up or the bus will take me away. I wanna go over here. Cause I think there's an ending. Cause I remember the demo kinda gave a uh a this this ending isn't here yet screen. Or something like that. Uh There we go. I kept walking endlessly through the black space in my mind. I wasn't worried. I've been here dozens of times. This is just a dream. I always wake up. So I kept walking. It's been a while since I started walking. I have no way of keeping track of time though. But even if I don't manage to find the way back, something in the real world will wake me up, right? I looked down at my hands, but I couldn't see them. I couldn't see anything in any direction, so I kept walking. How long has it been? I've been walking for such a long time. I haven't gotten hungry or thirsty. I'm not sleepy and my legs aren't even tired. But the sensory deprivation is really starting to get to me. But I wasn't going to get anywhere unless I moved, so I kept walking. I decided to stop walking for a while. It just seemed pointless. It was like an invisible treadmill as far as the eye could see, except that the eye couldn't see anything. Uh, will someone wake me up already? This is pointless. But standing still was even more pointless, so I kept walking. This. I can't deal with this anymore. I want to wake up. What kind of torture is this? There's no sounds, no colors, no smell? Uh, okay. Yeah. Still checking the sound. Even if I pinch myself, I can't feel pain either. I'm going to go insane anyways. So I kept walking. Help! Help! Someone get me out of here! Wake me up! I don't want to stay here forever. Please, I'd rather die! I can't stand it anymore. Ah. Um... What? Uh, Lacey, you don't have a face. And I can't go back into the darkness. And I can't run. I'm pressing shift and it doesn't let me run. Wait a minute. There's no door. There's no door. There's no... No fucking sticky keys. There's no door. I can't run. I can't. I guess I can just go here. Oh. Dead end one of three. Wait, what? A walk in the dark. 
Wait. Wait, so I missed an ending. Or a dead end. When? This door doesn't open. Um, yeah, okay. Welcome back, Lacey. We've missed you at school. Blah, blah, blah. It's always the same text. Don't know we'll be back in this spot next time, even if I crumple it. Blindly white light, as I can see. Students laughing at you. This isn't your locker. This isn't your locker. This isn't your locker. Still there. This isn't your locker. It's the exit, it doesn't open until I check the locker. Oh, what's that red thing? It's the first time I see it. Pick up red item one? Yes. These must be important for something, but I don't remember if the demo actually gave them a usefulness. I do remember a few ways to get them, but... Oh, well, hi. What is this thing? And by a few ways to get them, I mean one of them, but... Wait, the bus stopped. I need to get off. Wait, on. Let's... There's a timer. Let's let it run out. Good night. Yeah, the bus is starting to move. I should have gotten off. With no way to stop the bus, I just sat back down in my spot. After a while, I fell back asleep. Is there something about this bus that made people sleepy? What? I'm back here? A few minutes later, I woke up at the black place again. So I went through the whole thing one more time. And through the closet at last. Finally, I was ready to wake up again. Oh. There's no one here anymore. List of rules for the bus. No eating on the bus. The ticketing machine. An empty seat. An empty seat. An empty seat. Okay. Wait. My seat. <laughs> I can't... Oh. There's curtains where the driver should be. Take a look behind the curtains. There's no one there. It's just an empty driver's seat. Um, where am I? Look around. I arrived somewhere. What do I do now? A small light. It changes colors every few seconds. A bus. It doesn't seem to have been used in a long time. I mean, they're stacked on top of each other. A broken bus is stacked on top of it. 
A bus. It doesn't seem to have been used in a long time. There's another bus stuck on top of it. A bus. It doesn't seem to have been used in a long time. A wooden crate. I go back in the bus? I can. No point in, uh, in doing that, though. Garbage bag, where I belong. What well, seems like a trash bag. It has dust all over. A wooden crate. A wooden crate. Strange street signs fill the walls. A garage door. Can I get this open somehow? I mean, there's a thing here. A keypad. Touch some buttons. Yeah. The keypad doesn't respond in any way. Huh? Wait. Doesn't... Oh. Wait, this wall doesn't interact in any way. Okay. So I guess the only way is down. Well, it seems like a trash bag. Seems like a trash bag. My home, basically. A wooden crate. Um, a wooden crate. I'm gonna interact with with whatever I can, just in case. Looks like a mailbox. There's no mail right now. Oh. A large door with metallic handle. Open it. Oh. Frozen inside you see... Fingers. Wait. Arms? Are these... Human arms? Neatly stacked inside the fridge. There's... 50 or so arms of different sizes cut off from their bodies. Both left and right arms can be seen. Better not open it. Better not open it. Huh. Maybe next time I should open one of the other ones. An exit? Oh. Crap. It woke up. Hurry. Knock it out or something. What happened? My chest. You idiot, you hit it too hard. I know it's alive, but there's a hole in it now. Hole? What? I need to... Scream. Heck. You try to scream, but your voice isn't coming out. Your lungs might be damaged. If it dies before extraction, the boss will get mad at us. You're right, he might kill us off. Shit. Crap. Let's just bring it quickly. Fine, I'll do it. Ugh. It's dripping all over. This is so annoying. Why is it bleeding? I thought we were clear on this. I'm really sorry. It was awake. The driver must have messed up and... The driver didn't make this hole. Sorry, we didn't want it to run, so... Enough. With so few subjects as of late, you can't be snacking on them. I'll be reporting this to Glenn. Gah, what luck. Really, no. It's young, so it's probably fine. That's just especially why you can't mess with it. Voices. Turn it over. At least the hands are fine. Hand me the tools. Right away. Good. It's still breathing. Is that... A doctor? 
What's going on? Let's get this over with. Dead end four, carried away. Uh, I'm back here? Okay, sure, that works. And here I wanted to try and do nothing, but it probably gives the same ending. Red item one. A uh, hooded young man is lying down here. Pardon me. I need some help. Yeah, I wouldn't talk to me either. <sighs> An odd green man. Hey, that's me. Uh, excuse me. A creature with a huge mouth. Ah, it might be best to keep my distance. A scary looking monster. It's looking at me. A person holding what seems like a lamp with fish inside. Some colorful goop is dripping from the ceiling. Some purple blobs with Bases? If I push them together, will they disappear? The bus driver must be behind these curtains. Take a look behind the curtains. <laughs> okay, well. You died. Oh well. We try. Oh, for fuck's sake! Ah, well, alright. Sure, that works. These red items might be like the regalias from Pocket Mirror, where they are like. Like the amount you have kind of determined the ending. Picketing machine. Alright. She actually got off? Huh. This should be far enough. Doesn't look like they will chase me. This isn't the kind of place I expected. Another stop? I made it to a forest. Now what? Huh. Arrive at the forest. Voice of the trees. A crow standing on a rock. Doesn't seem bothered by my presence. Okay. A bus stop sign. The schedule is empty. It's likely that there's no bus coming. Trash can. It's overflowing with emptiness. This tree is clearly looping. There's little point in running around like this. <laughs> oh, 
the lamppost. I remember this part taking quite a bit to figure out. There's a sign that says Daylight Gate. It points straight ahead. The sign says Daylight Gate. It's pointing towards the trees. Yeah, these are incorrect. You have to... Uh, you have to rearrange them properly. The path looks like it should continue here, but it doesn't. Right, okay. It seems a bit loose. You could try to rotate it to match the other one. Let's do it. There we go. I don't know if I'm going to be still stuck in this forest. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I remember. Oh, no. There's another signpost here. It's loose so it can be rotated. Alright, I think I understand. Train station access. Rotate it? No. Objectives. Rotate the signs, explore the forest. I read the destination. I, I, can I find someone to help me? A sign says secret. Right, 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 right. Um, I remember this. Uh, let's do north. No, let's do west. That that was west. Okay, I am clearly sure. And I want to do the red one first because I'm pretty sure it doesn't actually matter toward to the ending. Um, hello. Oh. <laughs> Train station access. Let's point it. Not north. <laughs> that, uh. Am I stupid? Yes. Clearly. <laughs> Okay, this is secret. I think this is correct. So I follow this. Aha! So now, if I do not do that, and not do that, this, yes, there we go. Okay, so there's only two. I, I remembered more, but a dark pathway through the trees. Enter. And yeah. Larry just wasted time. It's a donation box. The label reads All proceeds go towards the construction of a bridge somewhere. We appreciate your donation. The lid is loose, and there's a strange coin inside. Take the coin? Yes. The box is now empty. Uh actually, yeah, I think. I think there was more, right? Daylight Gate, North. Okay. This goes in. Then this also North. Then this is east uh that entrance wasn't there before is it underground i don't remember this actually did i do this when i played the demo or was it not available i don't know i might not have done it just in general. Some posters with an eye crossed off. I do not remember this at all. Daylight gate. It's fixed in place so it can't be rotated. Okay.
It's not a good idea to go down there. A trash can. It seems to be filled with non-burnable trash. None of it is useful to you. A sign warning passengers not to jump onto the train tracks. Nah, that ship has already sailed. Or should I say, that train has left the station. A missing person sign. The photo frame is empty. I don't remember this part of, of this part in the demo. Yeah, I guess I it either wasn't available or I never did it. It was one of the two. A map of the train stops. Wait, a map of the train stops is posted here. The clock up there makes no sense. Yeah, it's all wiggly. I didn't even realize it was a clock. A map, a map of the train stops is posted here. The train schedule is posted here. It seems the train is currently out of service. I don't quite understand these locations, but it seems the train loops around a really large area. A lamp post. A large window. You can see an empty waiting room inside. A large window. You can't see anything through it. A lamp post. A coin-operated vending machine is filled with normal-looking snacks. Buy something. Potato chips. One coin. I don't remember if the coin was used for anything. Sure. Let's do it. This looks like a regular pack of chips. Eat the pack of chips. I feel like I could use this for something. No. Trash gun. It's full of train tickets. Pamphlets and such. Telly, the ticket seems to be used. There's a coin though. Oh, perfect. I wish I didn't just use the other coin to see what else I could have gotten. Oh well. Oh, I can go in here? A number dispenser. It looks like the numbers ran out though. Ads. Don't acknowledge them. A half withered plant. Yes. Do not acknowledge ads. Hire E2 Premium. Today. Looks like the ticket prices. A regular ticket is 20 coins. You got me fucked up. That's a lot of coins. For me at least. There's no one behind the window. There's no one behind the window. Yeah, no, I didn't want to talk to that. Okay, never mind. I can't talk to the paper. A trash can. It's missing the pedal thingy, so you can't open to check the contents. Coin up for the vending machine. It says out of order. Insert a coin anyways? No! An abstract painting. An abstract painting. It's just a flip version of the other one. At least they're honest. An entrance to some sort of tunnel. It's locked and doesn't seem to have been opened in a while. There's a pair of scissors here. Take the scissors. You have a bad feeling about this, are you sure? That means ending, let's do it! Well. Entrance to some sort of tunnel. It's locked and doesn't seem to be open in a while. It says it can't cut through metal. I didn't even plan for that. Okay. Oh. Well, that's nice. There's no one behind the window. You, uh, you okay there, Lacey? Oh, well, wow, look at that. Oh, hey! Descend onto the train tracks? Sure. That seems like a good idea. Walk down the train tracks in this direction? Sure. I'm totally not gonna get hit by a train. You take a number from the ticket dispenser. That's... Six. Rotate the signs. Too late for that. And pick the right path. There are three paths in front of me. And they take it as a hint for which one to pick. You got me fucked. 
So on, what was the ticket? I let me see that again. So the other tickets contain the same image. Okay. That's six eyes. Um Uh how am I supposed to interpret this? I guess Oh hi. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. Okay, sure. We try. Oh, wait. Okay, so that was the wrong path. Doesn't seem to be doing anything. Okay, guess that was the right path. Take a number from the ticket dispenser. It's a bug. Cute. Uh, wrong thing. Uh, there are three paths in front of me and a ticket. That's a hint for which one to pick. The bug was looking up, so I guess we go up. The tracks end here. Okay, I guess that was the right path. Take a number from the ticket dispenser. Death. Uh, is this the end of my life? That's a plan. That's also a plan. Okay, they're all... A potted plant sits dangerously in the middle of the tracks. That was wrong. Okay. So, am I back to- okay, okay, I'm back to here. Let's go down, because- oh, wait. This plant is yellow. Oh, I should have checked. This plant is dying. So the skull, never mind, apparently not. I thought I thought I had that. That was the first one that I genuinely used my brain for and apparently not. No, that was wrong. Never mind, none of them work. What the fuck? What do you mean? Huh? Okay. Is it because I didn't check the ticket or... Am I supposed to check all of the plants? Wait, what if I use the scissors on these guys? You know what? That's what I get for asking questions. Okay, a skull. Wait, does the skull literally just mean that any path is there? I think that might be it. What if I go back I'm not giving up just yet I know I can solve this the tickets from the dispenser probably contain a hint I don't think they do dangerous in the middle of the track wait <gasps> wait do I kill the plant with the scissors ah. let's do it for all of them can you, can you please? So let's go down. I feel like now that I've killed the plants, they're gonna let me through. Yes! What's this? There's a sign lying on the floor that says Daylight Gate. 
Pick up the blue sign? Okay. I don't remember ever picking this up in the demo, so... Oh! Well, there's no need to go this way. Or if I go back this way. Okay. Climb back up. I, I wanted to say yes, but sure. Well, I mean... I can go back in here. Huh. Okay, I'm surprised I actually didn't die. Like, this didn't result in an ending. Hmm. Um... Is it just me or this corridor is way longer than it used to be? Um... Okay. Ah! That's why. Okay. <laughs> the music has restarted. Like, the music is now the normal one. Okay. So... Daylight Gate. Uh, I guess now it's west. I don't need that one. I guess keep going west until you can't anymore. Then there's the secret. Wait, no. No, I guess not, actually. Hold on. Um, no, I guess this has to go... Not, no. Uh, what if I, no, um, put it downwards. What's this? Daylight gate. Fixed in place so it can't be rotated. Okay, so that one is the right way. So, north. And <laughs> I remember this puzzle because you can't actually reset it. I'm pretty sure. Daylight gate. At daytime, the gate opens and the lights turn off. Day? I don't even know what time it is. Is there any way I can get this to open without waiting? A cable runs, uh, lumps, the lamp, wait, a street, a cable runs from the lamp to the bushes, okay, I, I, I have a speech impediment. Cable runs from the lamp to the bushes, wasn't there a way to... Um, heavy looking metal gate. Is this the daylight gate? What does it have to do with daylight? There's a plaque on it that reads daylight gate. At daytime, yeah, 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 yeah. So I guess I turn it off, right? How do I do that again? I thought, hmm? Is that a button behind the lamppost? A street lamp. There we go. And then, hold on, just because I know there's a dialogue here. What? Wait! No! It doesn't... She doesn't have the, the dialogue that, like, resets the... Ah, I see how it is. I really dislike this kind of puzzle, though. Oh, maybe now she has it. Yeah, okay, there we go. Yeah, I 
kind of expected them to reset. Jeez, what was I thinking? <laughs> they said no cheesing allowed. No, no, you fucking idiot. Ah. No, stop. I don't Can I interact with them from the front? No, I can't. can't Oh my god, not even from the side Oh, I did it, somehow I'm genuinely surprised I did it It reads, stop, do not walk inside the fairy ring. But if you do, please ask them to take their business elsewhere. Hmm. <laughs> I mean, you know. I couldn't just not do that. What? What happened? It was so sudden. Am I trapped inside of something? I can barely move. Ugh, it's all soggy and squishy. This is suffocating. I don't like close spaces. Ah, I hate this. I'm going to be sick. Uh, okay. Wait. Calm down. I can move my arms somewhat. Think. Let's see. Do I have anything that could help me? Maybe something sharp? The scissors. Oh, scissors. Sorry, but I don't feel like being eaten today. Well, this is also new. I can cross off being digested alive from my to-do list. Good thing I had those scissors. Ugh. Now, where am I? There's plant similar to the one that caught you. There's probably no point. This one didn't even do anything. The plant I was trapped in. It's not nice in there. This one seems to be digesting something. The path ends here. Huh? Is there really nowhere to go from here? Um... Blue mushrooms are lying on the floor. This one is digesting something. Is this plant eating something? Or someone? Should I really risk opening it? Yes. What question is that? Oh. It's a person. Are they alright? They seem asleep. Well, I'll look around while they wake up. 
Ah! 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 Get it off! Get it off! Get it off! Oh god! Oh god! Get off! Did you just save me? Everything was so dark and so gross. I thought I was gonna die for real this time. That gooey stuff was eating away at my skin. It's so itchy. Ugh. I still feel it. I don't want it to eat me. Oh god, I didn't plan to get digested today. This is not how I pictured my death. What is this place? Oh. <laughs> no. We're in the fairy ring, aren't we? No, there's no way to get out of here. This is it, we're dead. I might as well go back in the plant. At least it will be faster. No, I don't want it to end this way. Hey. Cut it off. What? I said, cut it off. Ah, sorry. Is that supposed to be a joke? You know, I'm actually okay with dying. But I feel like being eaten alive isn't really the way to go, you know? I see. I guess so. My name's Owie. Lacey. <laughs> Were you trapped in one of those things too? Yeah. How'd you get out? Scissors. Whoa. If I get out of here, I will o- If I get out of here- <coughs> Fuck. If I get out of here, I will always carry scissors on me. I promise you. No. I swear to you. Uh, okay. What am I supposed to say to that? So, um... How do we get out? I don't know. We're absolutely never getting out. What are we going to do? Should I go back and get Ian by that plan instead? That might actually be better than losing my mind as I walk endlessly through this hellish place. Can you imagine it? We would go insane. I hear the fairy... I hear the fairy ring slowly digests you. Even if you're not caught in the plant. Eventually, the skin on our feet will start chipping away from walking through this visceral floor. Then we'll start crawling, and even our feet will no longer work. Hoping for the sweet release of death. We might even wind up eating each other. Owie. Cut it off. Right. Sorry. I'll look around first. I want to raise another... Uh, I want to take another look at the next room. Okay. Can I follow you? Yes, I don't see why not. Yay! I promise I'll be useful. You sure? Please to make your acquaintance. I wonder if this girl or boy can help me with my problem. Were they... melting? They might be a spirit or something. For now, let's focus on getting out of this place. Can I talk to them? Blue mushrooms are lining on the floor. Where is plant similar to the one that caught you? Well, I wanna... Kind of... The thing that almost ate Owie. It's wide open. Oh yeah, you cut it like that. The plant I was trapped in. Does this even classify as a plant? I'm not sure. It kind of looks like one. I mean, yeah, no shit, Sherlock. I mean, it has roots, so... I guess, technically? Huh? The path is open now. We need to walk slowly. And, uh, keep an eye out. Keep an eye out for what? For fairies. Lacey, don't you know what this place is? 
No, not really. Lacey, this is the inside of a fairy ring. Um... The mushroom circle from outside? Yep, that's the fairy ring. So this place is... Underneath that circle. Yeah. Oh. Can you tell me more? Let's see, I only know the things everyone talks about. For one, fairies live in fairy rings, and they're really nasty. Fairies. They look nasty too. They have this egg-shaped head that's separated from their body, and they're white, and they have big teeth, and some don't have eyes. But even without the fairies, winding up inside of a fairy ring is... Well, they say you get stuck here for seven years. But nobody has ever escaped because they usually just die before that. Oh god, this is horrible. We're not gonna escape. Even if we somehow make it seven years, that's only a myth. Maybe it's meant to instill hope in the poor souls that end up here. Like us! This is a dead end! Owie. Cut it off. Sorry. Are the fairies dangerous? Yeah. But everything is dangerous. The floor here is also slowly digesting us. I guess you don't feel it because you have shoes. <laughs> I only have socks, so it's eating away at them. Oh. Do I offer Aoi my shoes? Sure. Would you like my shoes? What? You're offering me your own shoes? That's so nice, Lacey. But no, I'll be alright. I'll just remake my feet if they start being unusable. It just burns, but that's okay. I'm used to burns. I'm used to burns. Um, okay. Various plants similar to the one that caught you. Oh, a hall. A glory hall. But before I check that... Never mind, let's check that first. There are so many branching paths in this game. There's a large hole in the floor. It's deep and dark. Doesn't seem very smart to try going down there. We sure are walking a lot. My feet don't hurt or anything, don't worry. I bet there's no way out. Hmm. There's always a way. Right? Whoa. I like that. There's plants. Oh. Hmm? Is that the bus stop? Not the current one. But we must be under the... But we must be right under the current one. Wow, we sure walked a long way. Did I walk all the way back to where I started? It's a bus. It has seen better days. Isn't that cool? Do you think they ever get passen- Do you- Do you think they ever got the passengers out? I can't see inside, so I guess we'll never know. Maybe it's best that way. I think it would ruin my day if we found corpses in there. Is your day not already ruined by being trapped in this place? Also, uh, owie. This is so fun. I haven't waited for the bus in ages. There's nothing fun in waiting for the bus. 
Looks like a piece of asphalt. Huh. It looks like a dead end. Okay. Guess we can't get up. It's a signpost. It's bent. The schedule seems to show quite a few buses coming every day. Strange. The other schedule I saw was empty. Oh, back in the day, the bus used to come more often. This is probably the old schedule. The other schedule you saw must be the updated one. Nowadays, it's very rare. So, if you're lucky enough to see the bus, you should definitely ride it. That's what everyone does, at least. I never saw it myself. It's just a bus, though. So, what brings you here? What brings me down here? I stepped into the fairy ring. Ah, right. Classic. <laughs> I also stepped into it. Yes, of course. So, what brings you to these parts of the forest? Um... Aoi definitely can't help me with my problem. This is basically a child we're talking about. So, there's no point in elaborating much, I think. I'm just looking for someone to help me with a problem. Someone like a doctor, or like an assassin? Probably more like a doctor, I guess. Oh, are you sick, Lacey? No, it's nothing serious, probably. I guess I'll be able to tell once I meet him. Oh. I had a friend I used to meet all the time, but... It was in the supply closet, in secret. But then they died. And now, I'll die too. What brings you to the forest? Oh, I'm on vacation. Oh, that's nice. Phew. <laughs> nice vacation. Okay, I feel like there has to be a better option than going down this hole. Alright, if down didn't lead to anywhere, let's go up. What's this? This must be under that weird fella's house. You know, the sculptor. Ah, yes, the sculptor. Not really. Oh, it's a cranky old artist. I've never spoken to him because he's in a bad mood where he, when he's tired. And he's almost always tired. But I think artists are really impressive. Sculpting is really hard, especially hands. I can't seem to get my hands right. Oh, that explains it. Wait, I should check the portrait. A bunch of rubble. Bunch of rubble. It's a broken street lamp. Bunch of rubble. A strangely shaped pot. I remember the sculptor from the demo. Oh, so what's this? No, there's something here. No, there is something here. Never mind, I guess not. Fuck. Okay, so both up and down didn't work. Or didn't lead to anywhere. What about here? This seems fun. Oh, yes, that's very fun. A large skeleton of an unknown creature. Hmm? What died here? Oh, yeah, look! <laughs> Uh, their hands are fucked up. Something big. Oh. A dragon. A dragon? Was I right? Uh, how should I know? Aww. A large skeleton of a dragon. Do dragons really exist in this place? 
Isn't it so cool that humans have dragons in their world? I'd like dragons here too. Never mind. The large skeleton of something other than a dragon. A large bone. Er. Um, well, okay, no, never mind. Wait, now that I think about it, in the demo, was it even possible to move the yellow signs? I don't remember, but I have this maybe Mandela effect where like I remember the yellow signs not being movable. Also, did I just? Oh uh, no, never mind. That's just a just a mapping thing, a collision thing. Uh, and I also don't seem to be going the right way. There's a large hole in the floor. We've checked everywhere else, but if I go down there, it will be impossible to come back up. Go down the hole. <sighs> Here we go. When I turn back, there's nowhere else to go, so we might as well explore whatever's down there. Okay. Going deeper down to find an exit. This isn't very smart, is it? What's that? Oh, it's a fairy. Oh, that? It's a fairy head. A uh, head? Is the rest of the fairy just buried? No, it's probably roaming around somewhere. But the heads are dangerous too, be careful. You don't tell me what to do. It only has a mouth. Is that why it can see me? It, is that why it can't see me even though I'm this close? Guess so. I don't need to see this dialogue again. I don't need to see this again. Thank you. This thing. Does it block the head's view? Wait a minute. Don't do that. Sorry, uh... What if its body comes here? If you stab it? Why would that happen? I don't know. I don't want to risk it. Fair enough. Better not to. Ah. Better not do that. This little planet is the only thing standing between us and those fairy heads. Better not to. Okay. There is another one. But this one definitely has eyes, doesn't it? Maybe they're nostrils? What? Nostrils? Could that be... They're nostrils. I suppose if... I, I suppose I hadn't thought of it that way. Anyway, how would we pass without it seeing us? I had to. Definitely eyes. Oh, come on. We're back here. Fuck.
Maybe their nostrils. Their eyes. That's ridiculous. Anyway, how will be passed without it seeing us? I'm not hungry right now. Oh. That... That was anticlimactic. Okay. As long as these black plant things are... are there, it should be possible to go around. Oh, well, good luck. Now there's a bunch of them. This is going to be a bad thing, isn't it? Wanna turn back? Wait, I can try to visualize a solution. Visualize a solution? Yes, please. Oh. It's probably something like that. Wow, amazing! On. This feels too easy. I want to try it without visualizing it. I'm gonna have to probably redo the whole thing, but you know what? It's fine. Oh! ah! I wanted to... Nah, it's fine. Owie, stay close. Okay. Oh, I can't visualize this. Okay. Going to bed. I'm tired. I'll check on you sometime tomorrow. All right. Have fun. Shit. Um, that was a mistake. Uh, I don't know why I did that. Okay, um, this. Then it has to be here somewhere. What's this thing? Uh, I guess okay, it can't see me somehow. Wait, how am I gonna get past this? Um...
Um, can I pass? No, I can't. All right. Well, how am I supposed to get through that? Um... I didn't even walk in front of it, but all right. The problem is that I can't... Also, it... Lacey just doing her idle animation with... with Owie just there. Um... I didn't walk in front of it though, what the fuck? Wait a goddamn second. It's facing the other way. I'm stupid. I'm so fucking dumb. Alright. That was actually really easy and I am ashamed that it was. Oh my god. Can we do this? Yes, I think so. At least we haven't seen the bodies of the fairies around. I didn't think that would actually get me. Okay. What? That can see me from over there? Okay, sure. I thought they were nearsighted, but alright. So... That's a fucking issue. Okay, that one just can't see me. Somehow. I'm directly in front of it. But it can't see me. Oh, there's a thing that has both a mouth and eyes.
That was wrong. All right. Well. Okay, so this not no. Um never mind, that was wrong. What the fuck is the view on these fuckers? Yeah, Sally, we can do this. Like their their eyesight is just inconsistent as fuck. No, that's not right. Uh No, 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 no. If I go up, they can see me. Uh oh, but I can go down here. This one can't see me because I'm behind it. I'm doing it. Cool, did it. Oh, all right. There's another large hole on, the, hole on the floor. Jump down, yes. It's not like there's anywhere else to go. Wanna turn back? No, the further away from those heads we go, the better. Okay. I'm starting to doubt there's an exit with how deep we've gone. Is that a fucking bathtub? Why is there a bathtub in a place like this? Maybe the fairies take baths here? At least it's not full of blood or something. It's a dead end. <laughs> Just sitting in the bathtub. What now? We're gonna die here, aren't we? I don't know. Oh god. I really hoped I wouldn't be right. I should have known. Of course it's a dead end. But I felt more confident walking around with you, so I thought... Please, let me think. Think, Lacey. Is there really no way out? Can't we break the ground above us and just climb out? How? Well, I don't know. Sorry, that was stupid. Can I call someone? There's no signal, though. Doesn't work. After that, we stayed in silence for a few minutes. We tried thinking of options at first, but quickly ran out of alternatives. Maybe there really was no way out this time. Through all of this, 
Aoi was awfully quiet. Um, hey. Hmm? Don't panic. It won't solve anything. What makes you think I'm panicking? You're mouthing. Oh, right. No panic. No panic. Wait. You're melting. Yes, I know! I can't stop! No, owie! I have an idea. Huh? There's a drain. And? Where do you think it leads? You want me... Do you want me to go through the drain? Even if I do, you can't come with me. Yeah. I, I got it. Don't worry. If this leads anywhere, I'll find a way to get you out. Just stay put. Really? Yeah. Well, let's hope there's a way. There's gotta, but there's gotta be a way. Okay, well, here it goes. Was that a good idea? How long has it been? Did I seriously just trust a spirit with my life? How he might not even come back. Wait, how he could have died for all I know? What did I do? Did I seriously just send Aoi down the drain to die? I should have said goodbye to Hiro when I had the chance. It felt like days had gone by. I don't know exactly how long it's been. But my phone battery died a long time ago, and I fell asleep for a while too. Despite this, I don't feel hungry or thirsty. I don't have hope that Aoi will come back anymore. I don't think anyone will come. Oh! Dead end, one of six. Ground swallow me up. What? All of that for a dead end. Oh my god. A crow standing on the stump. They're everywhere, huh? The sign says Alba's shop. A curtain covers the stand. Peek behind the curtain, of course. There are some trays aligned for display, but there's nothing on them. Bucket full of bones, another terrible sm smelling organic garbage. A campfire. There's no fire, so right now it's just a camp. A wooden log. Wooden log. That tree is massive. Probably marks the center of this place, which means... This is where the search really begins. <laughs> the roots of a massive tree. There's blue mushrooms everywhere. A lamppost. The note reads Due to the recent primal incident, we asked residents stupid enough to go inside to close the gate behind you. The gate locked with three padlocks. The warning sign reads No trespassing, risk of serious injury or death. Lamppost. I'm not confident in my ability to climb this and jump to the other side. A statue that looks out of place. A torn piece of paper seems to be stuck underneath. Take it? Yes. The hunter's letter. The note reads, Poor Marzi. You found my note. I looked everywhere. 
but there doesn't seem to be any other path to head north other than this one. Not that I know of, at least. They locked it because of the primal attacks. Things were getting out of hand. Please be careful when crossing it. Luckily for you, I got my hands on the keys and hid them around this area. The first one should be taped to the back of a nearby tree. The tree's color is all wrong, so you can easily find it. The second one is in front of the weird sculptor's house. There's a row of flowers, but one of them is actually a cactus. The last one is under a fake rug near the red docks. Just turn left when you see the sign. It's a bit hidden, but I, but I believe in you. See you on the other side. Okay. This is the sculptor's house. A pile of rubble. A large pile of rubble. What is this material? Clay? A set of colorful flowers, and a cactus right here. A cactus among a set of colorful flowers. There seems to be something hidden inside the pot. Padlock key, yes. There's also a note under the pot. The note reads, You got it! Luckily, the creepy sculptor man never comes out, so he'll never know about this hiding spot. If you're extra brave, I also hid some coins inside his place. Yeah, you know what? Let's do it. It reads, Exhibit closed. Exhibit closed indefinitely. If you have complaints, please redirect them back to where they came from. A tall vase. Reach inside? Yes. A thin coin. The sculpture is either broken or unfinished. You can't really tell. A realistic sculpture of a man with a candle for a head. What should I do? Touch it, take the candle, blow out the candle, do nothing. Take the candle. Because I remember there was a part where you need to light a fire. Leftovers of what was once a sculpture. Seems like someone has dug here recently. Check it out. Yes, a tin coin. There's nothing else of interest. One. Um. It reads exit closed indefinitely. If you have complete blah, 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 blah. All right. Also, wait. An artistic pot. Oh! Oh, yes. Okay, never mind. Um, that was wrong. I made a mistake. Please tell me that the game doesn't restart there. Please. I beg you. Okay. Thank you. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Um... Candle is not enough to light this campfire. Okay. I think there's a lighter somewhere, actually. Oh, right. Red's Treehouse. Oh, yeah, right. There's a character named Red. I'm in the game, people. There's an electrical socket heading behind the bush. What? The plug in the socket don't match, so you can't plug it in. Do I need an adapter? That's weird. What? What? Fucking, I didn't know about that. What the fuck? What? 
Wow. It almost feels peaceful being here. I wonder what other place in the distance is. Okay, um... Wait, what's it? Oh. An empty lamp that fell from the po from that post. Whatever was inside is gone. Can I find a use for this? Well, yes. Just... Uh, no you can't. There we go. A red tree. Hmm? There's a paper with something stuck to it. Take the padlock key? Yes. There's a note that... There's also a note taped to the tree. The note reads, Ta-da! Only a real professional... Only real professional tree huggers would be able to find this key. As expected from my best assistant, Treasure Hunter Scout. P.S. We should think of a better name for ourselves. Assistant Treasure Hunter Scout might be a bit too long. A little bit. Red tree. A big mirror is embedded in the tree trunk. Your collection stares anxiously back at you. I want to go to the sculptor's house first. Okay. A strange sculpture. Pile of rubble. Strange sculpture, a strange sculpture, a strange vase with even stranger contents. Worn art supplies are gathered, are gathering dust here. Blue paint. A small art piece. It looks like a dinosaur. A broken pot. A twisty pot. There must be a huge sculpture hidden under this drape. Check out under the drape. Looks like an unfinished sculpture of a lady. She looks like she's made of porcelain. Tall vase. Reach inside. There's nothing inside. A small art piece. What is this? Oh, coin. A painting of some landscape. It's the same one we saw in the station. There's someone there. Grab their attention? Yes. Right. Now we've run. He's cute though. Oh, that's kind of adorable. Look at that. It's so derpy. So derpy. So cute. Tired. So tired. Wow. Surprised I first tried that. That was a miracle. Alright. Let's go to my house. Do 
The cable runs into the woods against the cliffs. Uh, a cable runs through here. Runs through here. Runs through here. Son of a bitch. I forgot about that part. I'll be right back.
I'm back. All right. All right, let's continue. Um... Fuck. Okay. I don't think I kept any of the shit that I got from this. Um... Okay. Oh, wait, maybe I did keep the coins. There's a sculpture of a lady on this drape. Huh. I'd really rather not bother him. Oh. Okay, no, I guess I did keep the progress. Cool. Also, audio. Alright, seems fine. Thank you for the auto save. I appreciate it. Um. So anyway, I was trying to follow this. Uh, oh uh, yeah. The campfire is lit up by... Runs through the woods. A camp. Lamp post. Wooden log. Bucket full of bones and other terrible chronic organic garbage. see the objectives. Explore the forest. I have a meditation. Can I find someone to help me? And find three keys. Electrical socket hiding behind the bush. Yeah, so I... Where do I find an adapter? I guess... I guess we go to Red's house. Or, wait. There was something here, I remember. The floor here is unusual. There's a key hidden under here. Oh. Huh. There's a note as well. The note reads, What do you think? I think it's my best hiding spot yet. No one would search for something in plain sight. There's nothing else here. Right. So, I can technically go without talking to Red, but I'm gonna do that anyway. A strong lamp. Ooh, an interesting character appears. Someone's there? Nobody has come in a long time. I hope you can make it over here. A strong lamp. Yeah. Right, this. This is basically my training arc. There we go. What the? A trap? 
That was dangerous. Why are there traps here? Almost there. Be careful not to die. How much longer is this path? Only till you get here. A strong lamp. It doesn't look very strong. Be careful with the traps. There's more? Good luck! Oh god, that one almost hit me. A strong lamp. <laughs> ah! Got me. Everyone dies there. Oh well. Try again? Yes. I'm not skipping. That's insulting. Got it. A bag filled with garbage, probably. It's tied too hard to check the contents. A bag filled with garbage? No, that's a house. A small window. You can't see anything, so it might be fake. Thin vertical windows. A box with some birds trapped inside. Open the box? Sure. Crow. An empty box with a crow on top. This one decided to stay. What a cute little boy. Hello, myself. You made it. You must be really good at dodging spikes. Actually, no, he's not red, is he? Red isn't home. Thank you. He seems friendly. I'm surprised you're talking to me this much. Talking is, talking is an important means of communication, no? Well, yes, but... You talk as well. I do. But you're... What exactly are you? My name is Rune, and I like runes. Do you have any runes? I don't. That's terrible. In the future, if you have any runes, please bring them to me. I will give you my trinkets in, ex in exchange. Okay. So, are you some kind of spirit? Not exactly. We've gone by many names in the past. But humans often refer to us as demons. What's your name? Lacey. Miss Lacey. Rare to see a human around here. How exciting. You are a human, aren't you? Yes. You can tell? A little bit. A little bit? Some of us may have the appearance of a human, but it's easy to tell the difference with a real one. However, what about me? Even though you're a human, you smell a bit like... I can't speak of them, but it's someone very bad. Who is it? It's a thousand years of bad luck to talk about it. Please, I really need help. Um... I know that there's something off about me. I did this ritual to find out what it is and how to fix it. I see. For a moment, I thought I might be possessed, but... Ooh... Nonsense. Possessions are an outdated concept. Then, do you know what it could be? A curse! What? 99% of illnesses here are curses. What about the other 1%? What a silly question. There is no 1%. Oh. So, it's just 100%. Do you know how I can lift this curse? You should seek red. Red lifts curses. How can I find red? Incidentally, this is Red's treehouse. Yeah, I saw the sign earlier. I guess I should check it out. Thank you, Rune. You're welcome, Miss Lacey. Good luck, Miss Lacey. Very strong lamp. It doesn't look very strong to me. I know he's not home, but... Seems like there's nobody here. A large blue butterfly is on display. It's kind of mesmerizing. 
small blue butterflies on the display. It's not as mesmerizing. Four small blue butterflies on display. They're somewhat mesmerizing. A tree filled with blue butterflies. Is it mesmerizing? Tell me, Lacey. Is it? Some books about... Cursed trees, did it say? Read a passage? Sure. Despite their usual small size, cursed trees have a distinctive habit of extending their roots to a distance of up to 60 meters. Their roots extend even deeper underground. It is unknown how far they are able to reach before stopping. A small plant. The leaves look like they're tied in a bow. Some books about butterflies. Read a passage. A blue butterfly is a, a blue butterfly appears for each curse lifted. They are attracted to cursed trees and will burrow into the trunk, rendering it completely hollow in time. It is unknown why this behavior happens. A red doll. Both of its eyes are colored in. That's a Daruma doll. I know this. It's a doll that helps you reach your wishes. You color in one eye when you make a wish, and the doll will help grant it. In return, once you reach your goal, you color in the other eye, essentially giving the doll his sight back as gratitude. Hira reads a lot about this kind of stuff. I wonder what this person's wish was. Some notes on curse removal rituals. Stone curse notes. Can I even use this for anything? A book filled with extensive research on all sorts of materials. There's also an AC adapter in the drawers. There we go. A furnace. Inside is a thing. Is this art? It looks like a carcass of a sculpture of some sort. Some incomplete notes on removing curses. I don't really understand any of this. A furnace side of the thing. A simple chemistry set for mixing substances. Some bottles and other containers. Some pink plants are growing here. Some black mushrooms are growing here. Some purple mushrooms are growing here. Oh, wait, 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 wait. The carpet here seems suspicious. Take a closer look, yes. There's a ladder, but the entrance is locked with a padlock. No. Okay. Um. You can't cut through that with scissors. Can I cut through this with scissors? No. Okay... Hello again, Miss Lacey. Red was in there. Indeed, Red's in <laughs> Red hasn't been here for a long time. Why didn't you tell me? You didn't ask. That's true, I suppose. Do you know of any other way I could find Red? I do. Would you like to share with me? Sure. There is a lighthouse in the north of the big tree. Red goes there a lot. Have you seen the big tree? It's very large. You can't miss it. Yes, I have. Well, you have to head north to reach the lighthouse, but it's quite a long walk. It's right past the lake. But the only way to go north from here is to go through the locked site. Locked site. Near the big tree, there's a locked gate. If you go through there, you'll be at the lake in no time. But it's quite dangerous in there. And you'll need a light, since it's also very dark. I see. Thank you for, for all of this information. I expected demons such as yourself would be more hostile. That's a fair expectation. 
one that you should keep. If anyone finds out you're a human, they will kill you instantly. Take care. I mean... I think he says something. Okay. Oh, right. Um... Why aren't you hostile? How come you aren't, you aren't hostile like the other demons? I am simply well fed. Why do you collect runes? As for runes, why do you collect them? I like runes. What are you doing with them? Liking them. Is that why your name is Rune? I might have had another name once, but I don't recall. Red Street House. Why do you call this place Red's tree house? This house is not in a tree. But the house is made of tree. Do you mean wood? No. You're so odd, Miss Lacey. What did I find at the lighthouse? Will I find Red at the lighthouse? Maybe. Red often goes there. What if Red isn't there? The lighthouse owner is a friend of Red's, so he'll know how to get a guide you. He will not eat you, don't worry. That's good. What's inside the locked site? What's behind that fence in the locked site? Many just forest and a monster. A monster? It's okay. He won't kill you unless he sees, or sees you or hears you. It's very dark in there, so you'll need a bit of light. If you hear him approaching, you should hide. That doesn't sound safe. Is it really the only way to the lighthouse? It's the only way I know of. How did you cross the bridge to get all the way here? I walked. But didn't set off any traps? I must have missed them. Do you live here? Nope. I move around a lot. Why do you come here to Red's treehouse? I'm looking for more runes. Rune is humming a tune. It sounds very off-key. Doesn't he say anything about this? I remember opening this. <laughs> I suppose I could try this adapter I found. You plugged in the cable using the adapter. The campfire is plugged here. So this opened the campfire. I've only been here for a little while and I already have a lead. I really didn't think this would be where I find my answers. Might find my answers. Finally. A curse, huh? It sounds probable, but how did it happen? And who or what cursed me? And why? There's too many questions. I wonder if I can call a hero from here. Looks like I have, looks like I have no reception. Should I try anyways? It works? Lacey? Hero. Are you okay? How are you calling me? Are you back? Did you find out? Wait. Are you hurt? Do you need me to come there? Are you in danger? I swear I'll get you one. I'll get one of those letters and meet you in a jiffy. A jiffy. Hero. I'm fine. Oh, thank goodness. It seems to be safe where I am right now, so I just tried calling you. And it worked. Huh? That doesn't make much sense. It doesn't, does it? Tell me everything, where are you? I'm in a forest. A forest? You didn't pack... You didn't pack bug spray. There's more dangerous things here than bugs. But don't worry, I've got it handled. I just need to find a light and... Lacey, no! Lights attract bugs! Hero, I don't care about tiny bugs. Just trying to lighten the mood. That's my job. 
Hmm. Don't use up all your battery now. Remember, you can use the flashlight from your phone if you need light. That's true, how could I forget? But if I use up my battery, I might not be able to call you again if that's the case. It's up to you to decide if you need it. That's why I got the candle. Alright, I'll go now. You've got this. <sighs> Meet up with Cosmo, Millie, Millie and Alba. What? Uh... Okay. Welcome! Five coins each. Why a fish? She looks intimidating. What are you staring at? You heard me. Five coins each. No haggling. Or you could buy all my fish for ten coins. That's a pretty good deal. And I... And I get to take the rest of the day off. What kind of deal is that? I don't even have five coins. Uh, does that sound like my problem? Five coins each. No exception. Welcome. Five coins each. Buy all. They don't have enough coins. Buy. Alright. Talk. Ready to buy? What would I use the fish for? What do I care? Will you at least grill it? Do I look like a buffet? Scram. Where can I find more coins? Sorry, please forget about it. It doesn't seem like she wants to talk. Me, me, me. Meet, meet. Uh, nice to meet. Apologies, I'm not very good at speaking under pressure. He's worse than me. Cosmo. What? Oh, you didn't ask for my name. Yeah, I didn't. This interaction is not enjoyable. It's nice to meet you, Cosmo. Likewise, um... Your... 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 Your name is? Oh. It's, um... It's not important. Oh, okay. So... Why are you so bad at speaking? You think I'm bad at speaking? Well, you said it yourself, did you not? Oh, well... The truth is, I've been told I sometimes... ...stutter. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. D do you think I stutter? Do you think Cosmo stutters? It's not my place to say. Yes, it's very obvious. It's not my place to say. Oh, that's okay. Maybe I've improved and it's not so noticeable. Maybe. What are you doing here? Do you live here? No. Not many of us live in the forest. It's too distant, you see. Too distant to what exactly? The city, mainly. How do you get to the city from here? Is this a quiz? No, I... Well, it's, um, you can, you can take the bus or the train. Don't you know this, though? Come to think of it, where are you from? I should be going. No, 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 knock on his head. Ah, don't do that, it's fragile. Knock again. Stop. Back again. Um. This isn't what I expected. What have you done? Oh, no, 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 no. Please help me. Please find me a new head. A new head? Anything hollow can serve as one. Please. Hurry. If it all escapes, I'll... I'll... Um, anything hollow. Uh, I was not expecting that. Uh, I kind of want to see what happens, though. <laughs> I have five minutes. 
I mean, I do have this lamppost, but I kind of need that for the light. Maybe one of the vases? One of the vases from the sculptor? <laughs> yeah, this can work, right? An artistic pot. This could, this could work for Cosmo. Yeah. There we go. Give the he new head to Cosmo. Cosmo needs his new head. Hurry. Wait, actually. Strange looking vase in the shape of a hand. I kind of want to let the timer run out though. Wait, what if I now... The fire is on. It seems to produce heat too. Wooden log. No, I wanted to talk to him. A pleasure. Huh? You're not from around here. How do you know? You wander around anxiously. Oh. Sit if you wish. The fire is captivating. No, thank you. What should I say? Are you a bug? You have wings. What of it? Are you a butterfly? Disgusting. Oh. Uh, a moth is the correct term. It must be your first encounter with one. They say if you meet all nine moths, you get a reward. Folklore is all it is. All it is. Why would anyone give you a reward? So sometimes you get rewarded for hard work. I've already met four. What a fool. Nobody will reward you for... A scavenger hunt. The world is not a playground. You're too grim, million. What do you think, lady? What do I think? The world is really unfair. Hard work pays off. The world is really unfair. Such pessimistic views. It's wise to be realistic. Can you help me? I have a question. Do you happen to know where I could lift the curse? You must seek red. Yeah, this isn't the first time I've heard that name. Everyone has heard that name. Red cures all sorts of ailments. For a hefty price. That one doesn't do anything for free. So, after I find 8 more moths, I, I'll get rewarded? As I stated, it's nothing but a myth. So, what kind of reward would it be? I'll discuss no further with you. Million is ignoring you. Alright. Welcome. Five coins each. It doesn't seem like she wants to talk. Alright. I'm letting this run out now. In fact. Now is not the time for that? Oh fuck. I need to get this to Cosmo as soon as possible. Continue down this path? Yes. Oh wait. No! I was too late. Um, is he... Hmm? Shouldn't you know? You're the sole cause of that. Well said. I envy your naivety. Just like this warm flame, your innocence will... Your innocence too will soon be extinguished. Can you help me? Uh, I already 
checked all of this. Yes, it's very obvious. Uh, oh dear. Oh no! Please give me a moment. Apologize, yes. I'm sorry if I was rude. I'm not very good at interacting with people either. I don't get much practice. Really? Hmm. I think it's okay that you stutter. At least you're still able to convey your feelings. Thank you for reassuring me. Phew. What are you doing here? Do you live here? No, not many of us live in the forest. It's too distant, you see. Too distant too distant to what exactly? The city mainly. How do you get to the city from here? Is this a quiz? No. Well, take the bus or the train. Do you know this still? Where are you from? I should be going. expected all right well <laughs> artistic pot this could work for Cosmo I wanted to see what uh, what happens if the timer runs out and you're actually pr <sighs> Why? Well, fuck me, I guess. Okay, let's not get eaten. Is this okay? <laughs> I guess it could be worse. Thank you, I didn't think you would come back. It was my fault after all. You're welcome, I suppose. Cosmo is sporting a new head. Wouldn't look no. <laughs> I love the So, uh, now that I've done that, mm. I 
I want to try going over here again. So garbage. Oh, oh, a coin. How many coins do I have? On, um, I wanna. On, um, what attracts the butterflies again? I think there was something that you could use to attract them with. Small size cursed trees have a distinct habit of extending their roots to this. No. Not hungry right now. I don't remember. I remember there was some. Should I just look at my stream again? Like to see how I did it? Wait. Oh no, it's a it's just a it's just a branch. Fuck. Cause I remember doing it somehow. Of course. I wonder if she has an idle animation when when like sitting down. Does she? Um, doesn't seem like it. I feel like she would have done it by now. Yeah, I guess not. Alright, well. That was a good try. There must be something here. I remember there's something... I, I remember there being something here. I can't be misremembering, right? there was one side that had something like there was like a hint that someone gave you but it doesn't seem like it wait oh it shows the coins right there I have five coins no what let's go to that bitch and get one of the fish. Oh my god, I almost just stepped on that. Welcome! Five coins each. Bye. Obtained fish. Welcome. Five coins each. Doesn't seem like she wants to talk. Let's 
Southwest Sculptor's House. Where... I guess there isn't really much else to see. So, a lamppost. Might as well progress. I don't remember if we can go back or not. All right, there's the question. There's the question answered. I might not be able to come back after I go through here. Continue down this path. No, I want to do something before I. I want to keep exploring. There's something. There must be something that I can do. Street lock. Okay. There's no need to mess with it anymore. Maybe I shouldn't have used that one coin. Need to go back down. Um... Oh, hey, it's all back to normal. Can I put these back? Half of the plant. That's a dead plant. Okay. Number dispenser. Looks like the numbers run out though. I guess I got too curious. Um, okay, I'm back here. What if I just wait here for a little bit? I don't think anything's gonna happen, but I don't know. Um, did the music just change? No, it didn't. Okay, got. I just. <clears throat> well, that actually got my hopes up. Not gonna lie, that's disappointing. We're playing with emptiness.
I don't think... Okay, it doesn't respawn, unfortunately. Wait... I don't know why I'm, like, trying so hard to, like, the best, like, like, at best I can just, I can just restart the game and, like, go for the, mo the other endings, like, separately. There's a massive tree, uh, but I do want to open that thing. Wait, on the closer inspection, there's a door handle on the mirror. Doesn't seem to be locked. Check behind the mirror? What the fuck? The tree is hollow? I can't see the bottom, but it's really deep. Why is the inside of the tree like this? Door handle can be seen. Check behind the mirror. I think if I keep checking, something's gonna happen. Check behind the mirror. Hold on. Maybe they have something to say about that? Welcome, five coins each. Talk. No. Ignoring you. He's sporting a new head. What if I take a gamble? And say... That that tree is the way out to this. It was so sudden. Am I trapped inside of something? I can barely move. It's so squishy. Suffocating, I don't like closed spaces. I hate this. I'm going to be sick. Wait, calm down. I can move my arm somewhat, I think. Let's see. Do I have anything that could help me? Maybe something sharp. Scissors. I don't feel like being eaten today. Uh, yeah, but we're this boy or girl, they don't seem to be dangerous. May it's best to not be alone in this place. Wait, didn't they? Wait, didn't she? 
We need to walk slowly and uh, keep an eye out. Keep an eye out for what? For fairies, don't you know the places? Ralph for out in my shoes? No, best not. Who knows what this floor will do to my feet. This person is not human, so they will probably be fine. Wait a minute. Oh, I know where this is. This must be under that weird fella's house. You know, the sculptor? Yeah. I think artists are really impressive. Sculpting is really hard. Especially hands. I can't seem to get my hands right. Oh, that explains. Hmm. There's a large hole in the floor. It's deep and dark. We sure walk walking a lot. I wonder if maybe what you choose impacts the ending you get. Is that the bus stop? Not the current one. It's good that you have a light, in case it gets dark in here. I really hope it doesn't. Okay. A large skeleton but not known creature. Dragon. Alright, let's go down. Okay, let's go down. Let's go down. the options that you pick that affect the ending I don't need it okay Uh, 
There we go. Oh, we stay close. Okay. Not like that. Okay. Um. Let's try to be smarter about it. Fuck. It's 6 a.m., okay? Or stay close. Got it. I don't know why it was blocked off. Can we do this? Yes, I think so. I don't just think so, I know so. Because I did it once. And I will do it again. No, okay, well, not like that, but you still, I will do it again. Here and go here, then wrong way, I think. I think this way. Here, okay. There we go. First try, see? And... There's a larger hole. Jump down. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to redo this part and pick the right options. Oh wait, did that? That's such a nice name, thanks. Is that I was staying inside for a few minutes? Hey. Don't panic, I won't solve anything. I actually think I'm panicking. You're melting. No panic, no panic. Wait, you're melting? Yes, I know. I can't stop. No, owie. I have an idea. Huh? There's a drain. And? Where do you think it leads? You want me 
Want me to go through the drain? Even if I do, you can't come with me. Yeah. I got it, don't worry. If this leads anywhere, I'll find a way to get you out. Just stay put. Really? Yeah. Let's hope there's a way. There's gotta be a way. Here it goes. I think this is gonna be the same dead ending. Was that a good idea? No, because the... The options were probably not correct. How long has it been? I seriously just trusted you in my life. Oh, she used to say spirit. How oh, he might not even come back. Wait, how he could have died for all I know. What did I do? Can I seriously just send Aoi down the drain to die? Should have said goodbye to here when I had the chance. I feel like days have gone by, I don't know exactly how long it's been, my phone battery died a long time ago and I fell asleep while I don't feel hungry or thirsty. I don't have hope that I will come back anymore, I don't think anyone will come out, come back. Hey Milo, how you doing? Yeah, okay, this is the same one. But... If... Eat me, alright. But now, if I go back, redo this whole place with the... And pick the options that are, like, nicer. Will this ending be different? I'm good, can I ask you a question? Go right ahead. think of the mother uh the mother series uh i'm gonna be completely honest i never played it <laughs> i hear it's really good i never played it wait that might be a gm maybe i'd better leave them alone Just save me, everything was so dark and so gross, I thought I was gonna die for real this time. That ugly stuff was eating away my skin. Because they announced Mother 3, but only in Japan again? Ah. Hmm. Yeah, Mother has always been like, uh, like games that have been pretty much Japan only. Because, like, I think the first game was Japan only, and then, like, the second game was, like, was international but they made it like earthbound one i think they like is what it was like everywhere else something like that maybe i got it wrong i don't remember i heard about it like a long time ago i don't know because i feel like a lot of my favorite games have been inspired by mother so i should probably play it sometime First game actually got an English release on Wii U and Switch. Oh, oh yeah, I also heard about that. I just forgot about it. Huh. Just re-releasing. <laughs> just called Earth. Ah, uh, right. Earthbound beginnings. Yeah. Walk slowly and keep an eye out. Keep an eye out for what? For fairies? So you know what this place is? Not really. It's that circle, yeah. You can tell me more. Do 
stop probably my shoes? Yes. Right, okay. Okay, that's one. I don't know, maybe I'll play it on stream. I just need to find like the right emulators for it. I ordered a fan translated copy of Mother 3. A physical cartridge with a box? Nice! Uh I didn't think they would be doing like Japan only stuff again. <laughs> I feel like that's like something that is almost unheard of now. Well no not unheard of. I've I've actually there was this visual novel I was uh, I was interested in, and then realized nobody has translated it. So I guess it's not unheard of anymore, but it is still like a pretty old thing to do. At least it's not for something like it's not really something Nintendo really does anymore. So my three has always been exclusive to Japan. Oh, Mother 3 was already out. I thought it was like, it was like you or something. It just goes to show how much I know about the series. Did I? Wait. I didn't pick any options, did I? I swear to god. Hold on. I need to remember. Um... I hope it's fine. I hope it's fine. I hope it's fine. Should I reset already? I might have to. Uh, let me look back and see if there was anything that I was able that like had multiple choice. You know, I'll just trust my gut. Probably not a good idea since my gut isn't exactly good, but their nostrils. Okay, and then there's a bunch of them. I'll turn back. Yes, please. Probably something like that. Oh, amazing. Okay. Have you ever played Subspace and Brawl? I have, actually. Um, I don't have the game or the Wii anymore. Um... Um, I don't have my Wii anymore. I sold it. Uh, and with that, all of the games I had on it. That was not a good idea. Um, but yeah, I did play Substitute Emissary on uh, Brawl. Because I really like how Lucas teams up with Pokemon Train. Yeah. That was. A I didn't go. What? 
Sure. Fuck it. Um... I need to focus here because I clearly am stupid. Okay, finally. Um, but yeah. Does it look similar to Ness after he got turned into a trophy? Does he? Uh, um, but yeah, I, I think I also like how, how those two teamed up. I think it was also because I was kind of dreading to use Lucas, because I don't know how to use Lucas and Ness in, in Smash. So... Uh... Yeah, having to use a character that I actually knew how to use, uh, unlike this game, uh... was... uh... pretty welcome. I'm not an idiot, which I am, clearly. I mean... <laughs> yes, I know, Aoi. I was about to be an idiot again, which is kind of the thing I'm known for, but... Uh, okay. Here. Here. Uh, I don't think there's anything here. Then I can go... No, I cannot. Don't even think about that, you stupid motherfucker. Okay. And now this... Okay. Jump down. Okay. Um, want you to look similar to Ness? Oh, I don't think I ever noticed. Um, so you prefer to use Squirtle? Yeah. I much prefer to use Squirtle because I actually knew how to use it, and I just I don't know how to use uh Lucas and Ness in. In Smash. I think those are the two characters I know to use the least. Maybe like after Olimar. But yeah, no, I have no idea how to use those two. I, I really hope I didn't just waste all this time. I definitely have to play the mother game so I don't get spoiled. Oh. What now? We're gonna die here, aren't we? I don't know. But I really hope you wouldn't be right. Uh, I should have known. Of course, the dead end. I feel more confident walking around with you, so I thought. Please let me think. 
This feels way too important to just be for a dead ending. Think, Lacey, is there really no way out? Can we break the ground above us and just climb out? How? Well, I don't know. Sorry, that was stupid. Can I call someone? There's no signal, though. But it worked before. Nope. It doesn't work. Say, can you tell me your name since we might be dying anyway? It's Lacey. Oh, that's such a nice name. Thanks. After that, we sit in silence for a few minutes. Uh, I'm trying out Lucas and Ultimate. Hmm. Tried thinking of options at first, but quickly ran out of alternatives. Maybe there really was no way out this time. Through all of this, Owie, Owie was awfully quiet. Um, hey. Don't panic, it won't solve anything. If you think I'm panicking, you're melting. No panic, no panic. Wait, you're melting. No, Owie, I have an idea. There's a drain. Will they come back through the drain? To help us out. Because I feel like I picked the right options this time. But maybe I missed something and I don't really want to think about that. Just stay put. Yeah. Hmm. How long has it been? Did I seriously just trust the demon in my life? Oh, he might not even come back. Wait, oh, I could have died for all I know. What do I do? Did I seriously just send Owie down the drain to die? Are oh, you fucking kidding me? Oh my god. I did all of that for nothing. I should have said goodbye to you when I had the chance. Days have gone by. I don't know exactly how long it's been. My phone battery died a long time ago and I fell asleep for a while too. Despite this, I don't feel hungry or thirsty. So I hope that I don't have rope. I don't think anyone will come. God damn it, Owie. You motherfucker. <laughs> Well, um, fuck it, I'll just progress like a normal person. Mm. I tried, I, I tried, okay. I uh, hope you feel better. Yeah, I feel better. I don't have a hernia anymore. <sighs> Oh, what's this? There's a note on the floor. No note reads... Marzi, one last thing. This place is a maze. I left some flower petals on the ground to mark the way. I stole them from the sculptor man, hee <laughs> hee. Anyway, follow them and you'll reach the exit in no time. Yes, walk slowly and listen to your surroundings. Actually, no, I think following the petals doesn't actually lead you to the exit. But I'm gonna follow them anyway. Uh, Bush. Bush. There's quite a bit of blood in this spot. Where's the bush? Bush. Quite a bit of blood in this spot.
This is reminding me of um, a pink coin. Some someone's remains. You can't tell whether they're human or not. Bush, bush. I. You know what? I'm not complaining. I'm not. I am certainly not complaining. Someone's remains can tell whether they're a human or not. Bush. Bush. Pedal shot ends here. They didn't make it to the exit. Where's the bush? Where's the bush? I'm dead. Well, it was worth a try. Okay, well, that was stupid. I don't know why I even tried. Um... This reminds me of um, Little Goody Two Shoes, how there was a hiding mechanic in that. Bush, 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 where's the bush? There we go. Okay. Wait, where's the bush? Push, 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 push. Fuck! Oh, I was at the end. I was at the end and I have to redo it all. Son of a bitch.
defense blocks your path. Yeah, okay. I don't know. Did I do this first try when I played this in the demo? I feel like I have. Or at least I remember doing it first try. Damn. I peaked last year. It wasn't even last year, was it? I don't know, when was it? Like a couple months ago, probably. Um... This stream has been going on for way too fucking long, oh my god. Five fucking months. It was eight months ago, that's basically a year. Might as well be, you know? I'm back here at the fence. Why am I back here at the fence? There's no bush. Okay. I'm safe. For now. Bush. Give me a goddamn bush. I made it out somehow. There's no way I'm going back in there. I'm carrying too many things around. You got rid of some items. What the? F Arrive at the lakeside. What did I get rid of? I got rid of the candle and the lamp. Uh, something else. If the, oh, bottle of what looks like blood. That thing just turned to blood. Small burrow, reach inside. You can't feel anything special. There's a paddle inside. Take boat paddle? Yes. The pier ends here. A large structure looms over the lake in the distance. What is that place? Hmm. I can't see the lighthouse from here. It might be beyond those trees. Oh well. Go fish. Be free. 
Oh, I tried. Oh wait, there's something here. A notice attached to the tree. It says, The monster loves meat, hates water. Oh. Crow. Is it wind to take the boat? Cage attached to a tree. Looks like I could put something inside. Push the cage into the water? Sure. There's a bucket here. Take the bucket? Sure. Fishing rod. Try it? Yes. No. Blue algae. Well, hey there. Black algae. Black algae. Coin. That would have been nice for, you know, the fish lady, whatever her name was. The fuck's sake. Blue algae. Green algae, the best one. Green algae. I feel like if I take too much, something will show up, so. The cage is in the water. Pull it back up. I think I put the fish in there. Cage attached to the tree. The five coin fish rests inside. Rests inside. It's not even grilled. Take it back. No. Push the cage into the water. Yes. The monster seems to like what you put inside the cage. Oh. So what if I fish now? More algae. No need to mess with it anymore, huh? A shrine of some sorts. There's a bowl of a goldfish on it. Take the fish? Yes. Oh no. What's happening? What in the world happened here? A note details how to unclog some pipes. We have bigger problems right now. The water has turned blood red. To shine some sorts. There's no longer a goldfish inside the bowl. You think? Can you please get out? Thank you. Water is now a bloody red shade. Wait, actually. I mean, there's a pipe here that the faucet won't turn on. Oh, wow. A red rabbit. It's not breathing. Poor thing. No, I don't remember this. There's no boat, only red. Notice the Tesha tree. It says the monster loves meat and hates water. Red rabbit, poor thing. This way is closed off by trees. Loves meat, hates water. Oh, wait. Oh, well. <laughs> 
that end one of a part of your world. The, pub, the pipes get clogged sometimes. If, if that happens, just add some purple petals. A bit of black algae. That. And that's it. Make sure you get the colors right. The little keeper is delicate. Purple petals. Pink water lilies can be seen. Take some pink petals? No, it's purple petals, right? Oh. Boat petal here. Take it. I have a lot of black algae, so... That's not gonna be an issue. I just need some purple petals, wherever those are. Wait, those should be here, right? Oh yeah, there we go. Some purple flowers. They're growing abundantly between those rocks. Take some purple p p petals, yes. Let's unclog these waters. I don't think that's where I'm supposed to put them. No said something about a little keeper? You? The goldfish? You want these? And some black algae. Uh... Oops. Uh... Oopsie. Oh! Well, look at that! Hey there! I didn't notice you. Still there? Nope. Found. Oh. The way the temple is sealed off. Wow. Just kill me. Alright. <sighs> okay. Classic coming out of the water. Turn it on. Yes. Something's flowing near the stream. Door not fragment. Okay. has seen better days. I could probably take you north. What should I do? Get on the boat. Let's get rid of some items.
throw something on the log. It's completely unfazed by the rain. I made a mistake. I put it on the wrong safe. That's fine. Lavender flowers are growing all over the place. Pretty. Take lavender flowers? Sure. But why not? A small pond. A door with two doorknobs. Take a closer look? Yes. Hmm. A strange door with two doorknobs. And empty slots to place more. Amazing. My return doorknob fits right in. It wasn't a scam after all. Still, I'm not ready to go home yet, but I'm glad to have found this door. Right, I remember she was really important. There's a shadow of a girl sitting on the other side of the desk. Hello. I don't remember her having a portrait, but... Um... What do you do here? Is she giving me something? Rainbow potion. Oh, thank you. I guess. Rainbow potions will increase your endurance permanently. It is recommended to drink them as soon as possible. Doesn't see much for conversation. Various colorful liquids and drinks are stored on the shelf. Wait. This potion, won't it kill me? I feel somewhat stronger now. I remember she gave me something that killed me when I played the demo. Make it stop! Shut him up! I can't. I tried everything. Useless! Yeah, I swear I'm gonna lose it. Oh, good. So an else came. Hey, Blondie, take this stupid piece of shit and throw it in the lake or something. Squash it, strangle it, eat it, I don't care what you do. Uh... What? Our baby brother here has been crying non-stop for, for the past few days. Brother? In the terrarium. Aww. Euro Mox? We won't be for long before this obnoxious brat is going to make me kill myself. Ugh. Will you at least shut the hell up while I'm talking? Is he even saying anything? Would you be so kind as to kill it for us? Me? Kill the caterpillar? Yes. Yes! Why don't you do it? If we kill one of our kind, a curse is planted on us. Please kill him for us. We're willing to reward you with this doorknob. A doorknob? Why would he just stop? I'm exhausted! Um... Should I kill the caterpillar? Take care of it. Okay. You'll kill him? I guess so. Thank the heavens! Shut the hell up, you're dead meat jerk. Farewell, little brother. It has been a displeasure. What now? Kill it here. Alright, guess I'll just... Yes, kill it, do it. Quickly. Huzzah! Finally. Dead, dead, dead. We really appreciate it. Oh my god. The silence is so damn good. Here you go. You earned it. Not sure why you want this though. Thanks.
An empty slot. Place the doorknob. Return doorknob. Is it really time to go home? Yes. Alright then. First, to take the real lily from the vase. Now, to make a paper lily for my ladder. And finally, to place it where the lily was. It seems like it worked. I guess it's time to go home. Door is open. A white light is coming through. Go through the door. I feel like I didn't accomplish anything. I hope that this door actually takes me home at the very least. As I was crossing the door, I couldn't help but feel like something was wrong. Am I making the right choice? No. It's not time yet. God damn it, you bastards. An empty slot. Door not with eye. No, uh, while I'm at it, return door knob. Yes. I place my. Well, um, I didn't think it would lock me from picking the other doorknob. I just, I just thought I would, you know, place it just to, just for the sake of it. But no. This wasn't even an ending. <laughs> they didn't even mark this as an ending. Oh. Well, at least the other doorknob is here. A stairway? It's so dark, I can't see anything. Ah, uh, my head. What's going on? Huh? Did I pass out? That's not good. My head hurts. Wasn't I going down some stairs? I hope I didn't fall and break my neck. That would be a terrible ending. Uh... There's a... There's two doors here. Second door. Hmm? Lacey, there you are. I called you several times. Didn't you hear me? I need you to get me a. A what? A knife, Lacey. Oh. It shouldn't be too hard to find. It's in the closet in the garage. Okay. An empty dining table. A knife, Lacey. A knife. None of this can be used. The surfaces are completely flat and there are no handles. It only looks like a kitchen on the surface. None of this can be used. 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 There's nothing on the counter. Fine, I'll go get the knife. Oh, well, you know, that's... You know, convenient. No. It's not here. It's not here. It's not here. Oh my god, my eyes. I don't feel so good. What happened? 
Ah, looks like I got the knife somehow. A knife, Lacey, a knife. I got your fucking knife also. Can't tell what it is. Well done, off you go. Thank you. Pick up red item too, thank you. Off you go. Oh. That's close behind you, okay. Where am I? Is this a prison cell? I need to find a way out. I have the facility. Oh, yeah. It was just open? That's not me. Someone else must have been kept in here. Looks like human bones. Looks like human bones. Looks like human bones. This vent is suspicious. It's almost like it's inviting me in. These are my things. Most of it, anyway. I didn't even notice I'd lost them. Why are they here? The drawers are empty. Nothing here. Unbox and remove the vent cover? Yes. Go into the vents? Yes. There he is, the boy. Ow. There's someone there. Wait, I have something for the situation. Did you just... Did you just throw salt in my face? Yes. Uh... Why? I thought you were a demon. And if I was a demon, you think table salt would have stopped me? I... I didn't have any holy salt. That's ridiculous. Salt has no effect. I read it somewhere. This is the funniest shit that happened all week. Sorry, sorry. I'm sorry. God damn, this music builds up a lot. What brings you to a place like this? Oh, I see, I see. Wow, really? What are you talking to? I didn't say anything. I know, it's a joke. Just filling the set, filling the silence. You're not really talkative, huh? No, not really. What? Wait, you're just leaving? Yes. That's not where the exit is. Why don't we...
On second thought, that direction's good. Go, go, go. You don't want to run into that thing. Better hide here. This place looks worse than staying out there. Holy crap, this room is worse than just staying in the hallway. Indeed, the expected outcome of a light switch. Let's not do that. A closet for medical purposes. It's empty. Save for some dirty rags. It smells really bad. Closet for medical supplies. Closet for medical supplies. There's something in the drawer. Obtain the fuse. Fallen book. Read the passage. The soul does not reside in a specific physical location. The torso must be dissected in its entirety in order to in order for the extraction to be successful. A whiteboard that has been mostly erased. Only a few sticky notes with strange symbols remain. A broken container. Whatever was inside is long gone. A cage filled with bones. A bloody bag. It smells putrid. An operating table. It has faint blood stains. Medication bottles and small bones fill the countertop. Medication bottles and small bones fill the countertop. An operating table. What's with this? What's with the strange shape of this bed? Didn't catch your name earlier. Yeah, I see. What's up? What? What was that thing? Huh? You can talk? I don't know. They call it a primal demon. Primal? Well, if you consider all these lively fellows you encounter demons, then that would make those shadowy ones primal demons. Hmm. What else do you know? I know lots of stuff. About primal demons? Ah, about that. Not much. I know they'll kill whatever crosses their paths. Contrary to other demons, which mostly only kill if you're human. Hmm. Let's wait here a bit longer. There's a gate, but it's locked. It might be gone. It's up to you when you want to go back out. On, I remember there was a way to open that, but I forgot how. So it must be dissected. I think it must be something else. I guess the coast is clear. Will I find any clues in a place like this? <sighs> Maybe I should focus on getting out of here. All right. Um, did I adopt a stray? 
Are you following me? Yep. We stand a better chance together, right? Don't worry, I won't be dead weight. Well, unless I'm actually dead. But then you can just leave me there. Like, you can just pretend I'm not here if you want. See? <laughs> right, I remember this. This part took me eons. A tree that seemed to be growing out of the concrete floor. Unusual place for a tree. Oh. Miss L. Shh. I don't give my name to just anyone, Rune. Very wise. What? You told this goblin your name, but not me? You're still suspicious. Suspicious? What can I even do with your name? This is ridiculous. I read of a curse that can kill someone just by writing their name in a notebook. Is that the same place you read about the salt? <laughs> I love this so much. Hello, Mr. Sai. Yeah. Rune, you know him? Yes, though my encounter with Mr. Sai often brief as he does not provide me with runes. Oh. Give me a break, man. It's not like those things are just lying around. How did you get here? I walked. I see. Unfortunately, I'm still looking for the lighthouse. Ooh. The lighthouse isn't here. You must have taken a wrong turn somewhere. And there's no way to go back outside from here. What? We're stuck here? Possibly. Some doorknobs are one way only. Rune, do you have any idea where I could... Go from here to reach the lighthouse. The only way forward is by going deeper down. The stairs are right there, in fact. <laughs> that looks like a dead end. Yes, death is highly probable at all times. But I heard there's a cursed door down there somewhere. If you're lucky, it might lead you somewhere. Or if you're unlucky, it might not. Another cursed door, huh? If there's a cursed door, then maybe there's a way out of here. Or at the very least, I could go home if I'm stuck. I have the doorknob after all. That doorknob. When I got it in the mail, it came with instructions, almost like a ritual. It involved folding my ritual letter into an origami lily and placing it in some vase. I thought it was a joke, but... I'm starting to get tired. It's imperative that you learn how to fold it. If you don't, you regret it. Anyways... I brought the folding instructions with me just in case. Yo, you there? You're spacing out. Huh, yeah. Good luck on your quest! It's locked. Huh? A bathroom? Um, excuse me. Could you wait outside? What? Oh, of course. I I guess I'll stay out there. Excuse me if you need me. I won't. Now I get to have some time away from that guy. Is it really safe to have him around? Here would tell me to have a bit of faith in others, but... I wonder if I could ask Hiro. Is it even possible to call from here? I still have no signal, but that didn't matter last time. I'll give it a try. Hmm... Lace! Oh, good. 
Thank goodness I can reach you, Hero. Are you alright? What happened? Are you safe? Yes, I'm okay. Though, I did fall down the stairs and wake up in some sort of dungeon. And there's a strange guy following me everywhere. And Rune said there's no way out. Everything is okay, don't worry. Thank God. Is everything alright? Why are you whispering? Because there's someone right outside and... An enemy? No, well, he says he's not. And now he's following me around. You made a friend? No. I don't really trust him. But maybe it's better to have company. You might be willing to tag along and help. But that's why it's strange. Why is he willing to tag along? You know how people act around me, Hero. And he's just acting like nothing is wrong with me. Hmm. You sound conflicted. Well, I don't really care, I just... He's just shady. Well, I'll tell you what, it's your choice. You can have him tag along and see how it plays out. Or you can ditch him. Huh. It's not like... It's not like you to suggest something like that. Well, I personally think... You should have a bit of faith in him, but it's up to you. Yeah, that's more like it. I should go. Be careful, Lace. Get back home safely. Yeah. More hand towel. Rusted sink. Everything here has been gathering dust for a really long time. There's something on the shelf. Oh. Nothing else to use. That took a million years. Were you talking to someone in there? No. Did he ever hear anything? It kind of sounded like it. I wasn't. Oh. It's cool. I talk to myself sometimes too. Like having a little narrator, right? So I joined your party. A large window shaped like a clock towers above you. The time is set to midnight. The silhouette of a large clock is reflected here. Oh. There you are. How did you get in there? I got zapped like there was something keeping me out. Really? You didn't even notice me gone? No. Cold. So, what was in there anyway? Anything fun? Yes, very fun. What? Really? What was it? I can't tell you. Huh? Why not? Because it's more fun that way. No way, don't do me dirty like this. It's strange though. Why wasn't he able to enter? Yep, there it is. A small field of white lilies. Just...
A small golden music box. Play it. Such a nice theme. Wait, it ends? Oh. Oh. Music box enjoy. Well, I didn't even know it ended. I was just listening to it. <laughs> Wait, he wasn't following me. Like he like he wasn't um locked out. Large gate blocks your path. So what is this place? What exactly is this place? Don't know. Nobody's been here for hundreds of years though. Interesting. What do I do about the primals? There's shadowy looking demons roaming around this place. Indeed. They are called primals. Best not to approach them. Told you so. How do you know Sai? You two said you had several encounters with each other. I do a lot of rituals. A lot of rituals? And you've survived? You almost look disappointed. Room bounces up and down. Can I I I wanna find runes to give him? Wait, I remember this part being so cheap. It's locked. Wait, these two doors will open from the outside, will only open from the outside, so I'll stay here and I'll hold it open for you. Alright, so I left the party. There's a valve handle in the drawer. Take diamond handle, yes. It's locked. Confinement door is locked. There's something inside. Confinement door, it's locked. It's locked. It's locked. Guards are empty. Wait, this is where I started then. I guess we're from the outside. If I go through here right now, it would take him a while to realize I left. I could get rid of him that way, I think. Go through the vent and leave side behind? Yes. Safe. Miss Lacey, have you misplaced Mr. Psy? Uh, something like that. How come? I'm just more comfortable being alone. Oh, I feel the same. Anyway, how did I miss the lighthouse? So, I went north, but somehow I didn't come across the lighthouse. Where did I go wrong? Hmm. Did you reach the lake? Yes. Did you cross the lake? Yes, I took a boat. You should have been able to spot it from there. 
Oh, I couldn't see much because of the fog. So I just tried to keep rowing in the same direction. I must have taken the wrong turn somewhere. That's too bad. Can you tell me how to get out of here? If this place is a dead end, how do you intend to leave? I will stick around here for a bit longer. But after that? After that what? How do you plan to get out? I don't plan to get out for the moment. I'll stick around for a bit longer. But... Miss Lacey, I will stick around here for a bit longer. I see. And more about Sai. Do you know anything else about Sai? What kind of person he is? Hmm. I don't know. He never talks about himself. And he never gives me runes. I see. Is he a demon? He's not. Oh, really? Although there is something different about him. Much like you, Miss Lacey. I wouldn't tell right right away that he's human. Normally I can spell it from quite far. Oh, strange. If I pass through here, that guy might see me. And... That guy might still be waiting for me. Better turn to where he is? No. I want to see if I can do this completely without him. Um, press the button, sure. Yeah, nothing happens. As expected. Um, moon bounces up and down. I want to give him some runes. Because he's the bestest boy. It's too high to reach. Let's go back to where he is. <sighs> oh! What? How could this happen? It wasn't that long. Is this... Is this really him? Maybe I should get out of here. It's probably dangerous. What's that? This is... Doubt. Well... Wait, something shiny can be seen at the bottom of the toilet bowl. Fish it out? Yes. Oh. It's just a coin. Um. Let's 
sink, busted sink, busted sink. God damn it. I don't know. Um. The path forward is flooded. Deeper down. Do we have to go this way? That's impossible. Does Rune expect us to swim? Hear me out. What if we took all this water and put it somewhere else? Do you have a screw loose? Look, I know it sounds crazy. And we need a bucket. It's impossible. And it would take a lot of trips. I can't believe I'm hearing this. But maybe we can lower the water level somehow. Before to go save. Save, please. I'm tough it's the same one, but I'm glad to see it. Are you friends with the crows? Sorta. They appear here and there like save points. Okay. I'm just gonna end it here. Uh, for it, you take over. Um. All right. Anyway, we're back here, and I was lost, but I think that I'm an idiot, which is not surprising in the slightest. But I think also. I'm a fucking idiot. Let me just... I forgot to check the audio, but... No. Nah, it's fine. Oh, no, wait. Um... Never mind. Guess I'm still lost. Or... Or... No, I'm just an idiot. Okay, no. Nothing happens. Yeah, I, I am an idiot. This was where I was supposed to go last time. And I just didn't do it. Okay. Great. This is the one place I didn't check. You dropped something. To-do list before you die? Give it back, please. You didn't complete it. I know. So why do you... Um, I mean, that list looks... Pretty depressing. I'm aware. Do you want to talk about it? No. Got it. Be right back because I have a headache. Alright, take care. I saw to place a valve wheel. The indication has a square shape. I have a valve, don't I? That's objectives. Inventory, yeah, valve. Diamond. I mean, it's unbreakable. All right, there's a valve handle and a key on the barrel. Take the handle, square and copper key. Yes. Okay, found the handle. Handle square handle. Oh, okay. You place the handle in the slot. Turn it. Sure. The wheel won't turn. Alright. And then the diamond one. This handle in the slot, I don't think it'll turn. The wheel won't turn, yeah. What's this? There's a note here. In case of emergency, drain and flood system. In order for the draining system to work, the correct fuse must be must be in place. Rotate all four valve handles. This will activate the flood. It is irreversible, so don't do this without notifying the the rest of the notice torn off. I'm back. Do you need to get medicine for my headache? Ah, okay. Welcome back. Looks like an electrical panel. Take a closer look. Yes. Just let me know if the if the audio is too loud. Um, right. This needs to make 55. I think they all need to make 55 if I remember correctly. What do I have? Fuse may fit. An empty slot for a fuse may fit. 
Looks like I have to rearrange the fuses to match the display. Place a fuse, I have number 5 and number 40. Uh, 5. You hear something unlocking in the distance. What? I didn't hear anything. You're breaking my immersion. <laughs> Uh, okay. Um, anything in here? Some large lockers. You could probably fit inside. There's something in here. Oh, a fuse. There's nothing else of use. That was a, a fuse 10, which would make 55 here, I believe. No, because this fuse is broken. Never mind. Take out the fuse? Yes. Let's throw this damaged fuse away. Why? Just use it as a zero or something. No, that's really not how fuses work. A broken fuse won't complete the circuit. I see. So it's zero if you remove it? No, that's just... It also won't complete the circuit. You can't make a zero. Just leave this to me, okay? Roger. Actually, this also doesn't work. Um, wow, oh, then I'm gonna need the 25. I have fuse 40, don't I? Yeah. Okay. So now I just need to make 55. A heavy barrel can't be moved. At 6 p.m., I will be leaving your stream because the new VTuber is going to stream on Twitch and YouTube. I really want to see it. Ooh, 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 I wanna know. A heavy barrel can't be moved. Who is it? I wanna know. I wanna watch too. A heavy barrel can't be moved. A large machine attached to some pipes. Some sort of machine. It's whirring loudly. Okay. A door unlocked somewhere. Big bucket, of course. Cool, it's a bucket. You can do lots of things with that. Like? Hmm. You could try removing all the water with it. No Queen Bennett? No, I have not had the time to watch pretty much any VTuber. Let me check. This is the door to the surface. Huh? It's locked. Are we trapped after all? Oh. It's, uh... It was original... Yeah, they were like, uh... Like a, a flesh streamer, like a face cam streamer. Uh, what what did the dialogue say again? Uh, run. Are we trapped here after all? It can't be. I just came through here. Do we need a key? There's no keyhole. Huh. Good eye. Just have to do as Rune said and go deeper down. Okay, but there is no deeper down. Oh, wait, unless the elevator works now. Oh, oh hey there. Rain will make use of your spot. Hold C to sneak past enemies. Wait. Oh, I did not. Was this in the demo? Am I just retarded? It's not smart to call it when there are creature when there's creature when there's a creature so close. Jesus Christ. Oh no, never mind. Can't. Okay, well. I did not know this was here. Still there. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, we need to find one of the fuses. It's locked. That was... Which door was that? It's a button. Party controls the gate. Press the button. It works. Yes, Live Vito is going to be a Vito because he... 
Oh, he used to be Kyo. Oh, damn. Wow. Is this a meeting room or something? What do you think they held meetings about? Wait. Who do you think held meetings? Looks like a room where you would plot world domination. Think those windows lead anywhere? You okay? Yes, I just have this persistent headache following me around. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> uh, wait, something here. A chair, it's nailed to the ground. There's a coat hanging from the chair. Put it on. <laughs> That's way too big for you. It's cozy, I suppose. I wonder who wore this. Oh. Hey, what's wrong? Wake up. What the hell? Hey, wake up. Hey. Damn it. Dead end one of ten. Sensory overload. God damn, what was that? Um... I know we can take it because I took it in the demo from what I remember. Check the pockets, right. There's a note in one of the pockets. Meeting 221 notes. Members are growing increasingly restless. Expressing disapproval for Lilith. Might be planning to oust her. Could get ugly real fast. A round table. It's almost like an eye? There's a valve handle on the desk. Take the pentagon, yes. A bright imposing window. 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 A chair, it's nailed to the ground. A round table. A uh, chair, it's nailed to the ground. I guess silver stuff with them and they they confess that they're not good to the livers. Yeah. We kinda figured that. <laughs> yeah. I kinda gave up on, on EG as a whole. This game looks cool. This game looks creepy and cute at the same time it is yeah nothing happens uh pentagon place the handle in the slot turn it i can't oh oh i can turn the wheel nice Okay, now I just need to find the other shit. So, does the elevator work now? Nothing happens. God damn it. Uh, Rune, what do you have to say? By the way, the way to go deeper seems to be flooded. Indeed. Do I have to swim? Do you? I wonder. <sighs> you can tell she just had enough of this shit. It's locked. Nothing happens. Wait, there's nothing here, is there? I remember being here a couple times. 
and tell. Um, wait, I don't. Was in there? I left the party. Oh yeah, the, one of them leads to an ending. Uh -huh. So I joined the party. All right. So I left the party. One last bell, but I don't think I can get it here, right? Like it has to be not over here. Um It has to be not here. That's just a music box. That I apparently got an achievement from. I <laughs> didn't even know. This is locked. Okay. Surely, this has to have something, right? Time set to 12. This, the symbol of the large clock reflects here. Fun. I imagine it's like you have to set your clock to 12 a.m. or 12 p.m. Well, let me, let me check. Um, doesn't seem like it. Okay, well, it was worth a try. Uh, I'm about to just give up and use the bucket. <laughs> Maybe it'll lead to something. Let's try. Obtain the bucket of water. Oh! Are we doing my idea? No. But it might work. Just have to pick up water from here and empty it somewhere. And just repeat and just repeat that a couple times. Or a lot of times, right? We just need like a bathtub or a sink or something. Eventually, the water level will be lower. This is ridiculous. Come on. I don't remember what this bucket was used for. What if I use... Sure, buddy, whatever you say. Right. I forgot how how cheap these guys are. But can you just see me? You know what? Fucking Damn it, I tried. Wait, copper key. I forgot I got this thing. God damn it. Wait, he should be gone, right? Yeah. No, he's not. I'm a fucking idiot because there's a locked door like somewhere there. Unless it opens this, but I doubt it. No. I 
it's this, I think. No, it's not. What? <sighs> Fuck. The other door. The other door. God, this part drags. Okay. Uh, this door. This door doesn't open, so it's probably a key. Yes. The key fits. Hmm. Ah, I spot a shiny over there. Uh, shiny? You know, a useful item. How do you know it'll be useful? Might need to push some boxes around to get it though. Or arrange the boxes? What if I say no? I don't have the brain power for this right now. You know, I could just jump over those boxes and get you that thing. Outside to get the shiny? Sure. Alright, knock yourself out. Be right back. Moments later. Easy peasy. Well, that was something. Arrange the boxes? Yes. still no no way that was stupid all right reset um oh i didn't even realize it reset all right Made me climb over all those boxes for nothing? It wasn't for nothing. Exercise is good for you. Ha! Huh? I can't believe this. <laughs> Ventilation shaft. The cover is screwed in. Bookshelf with few remaining books. Read a passage? Yes. All the pages are blank. Purple book. Read the passage? Yes. All of its pages are blank, but you can see a faint outline of some letters. Have all of these books been erased somehow? Someone didn't want to leave any traces here. I agree. A bookshop with very few remaining books. All of their, pas all of their pages are blank. All of their pages are blank. Empty bookshelf. Bookshelf with few remaining books. Of their pages of life. Okay. Better not see a fucking ghost. Okay. Alright, let's ask Rune. Rune bounces up and down. Never mind. Wait, actually. I'm curious about something. Because I can technically do this. I can't believe I'm entertaining this idea. <laughs> this is the stupidest thing I've ever done. Just a few more trips. No way. Hold on. How many times do I have to do this? Hold on. This is gonna be really funny. Here, I can carry that for you. No. I can do it. Alright. 
where I gotta see that. Wait, did I? Wait, huh? Oh, no, that's just the texture. All right. I thought like a line was created for some reason. This will work, you'll see. There's no way. This is gonna result in an ending. <laughs> How many trips do I have to make? Like a hundred? Imagine you just go like At least it's a good workout. I'm not fit enough for this. doing something because it didn't use any dialogue but... what are you doing nothing we're lowering <laughs> we're lowering the water level oh this looks highly inefficient <laughs> yeah well why don't you help then it'll go faster that's okay. I'm satisfied over here. <laughs> what an asshole. <laughs> I love you. curious to see if this actually does anything. Wait, huh? Oh, okay, I don't know why I didn't. <sighs> what makes you think the drain isn't connected to the water we're removing? Hmm, I don't know. Well, too late to consider that now. No way this is actually doing something. It is it just me or is this actually getting lower? Is it just me? What possessed me to agree to this? <laughs> the player behind. Um, sorry. <laughs> Can you imagine all of this and it just ends? It it just it's just an ending where it kills you after all this effort. No way, right? Hey, I think the water level already went down a bit. It hasn't moved at all. <laughs> Okay, never mind. Outside is just so optimistic about all of this. Wait, there's 
Let's go die again. Um, is this actually gonna do something? Surely. Surely this is gonna do something. Really? <laughs> We're really bonding over this, don't you think? <laughs> this is great. This is amazing. Hold on, let's do this. Bucket of water. I can throw it in here, right? Oh, hey. One eternity later. <laughs> you actually did it. Congratulations. This is nothing. Just wait until you hear my other ideas. I very much look forward to it. Will she be okay? She'll be fine. See, she's still breathing. It actually worked. No. <laughs> you ready to go? Yeah. <laughs> stupid problems require stupid solutions. Please, I don't want to see this thing ever again. <laughs> oh, that's great. That's amazing. Objectives updated. There are stairs that go further down, but it's completely flooded. Of course it is. Wait a minute. Nothing happens. A house? Why is there a house so deep on the ground? Oh. Maybe someone lives here. What if there's an entrance to a house down here? Maybe there's also an exit on the other side. Don't you think? Well. No way but to go for- Wait. No way to go but forward. A mailbox. It's empty. Can't see anything through the window. Can't see anything through the window. Okay. A coat hanger. I'm keeping mine on. Little flowers in the vase. Looks like a guest book. It has no signatures. A vase with a single flower. A floor lamp. A painting that's mostly just blue. Touch it. A bunch of blue powder sticks to your finger. You wipe it off. Right, I remember this is actually needed for something. A painting that's mostly just blue. No. No, I, I meant no, but... Alright. Um... A portrait of... A person with tentacles for a head. A portrait of a person with a flower pot for a head. They must smell really nice. I wanted to read that, but alright. Hang on a sec. Over here. This place is strange. What tipped you off? The hallway filled with the creepy faces? No. No! I mean, yes, but... Don't you feel this place is strangely cozy? It's almost like it's decorated with care. 
Now it's cozy. What are you doing? You can probably relax here for a while. It feels like a bad idea to relax in someone else's home. If we're quiet enough, they'll never know. Besides, aren't you tired? Yes. I mean, after all, <laughs> after fucking emptying out the entire thing with a bucket. We deserve a break anyway. You're right. You're right that this place has a creepy but cute vibe to it. The fireplace is... cute. The fire is nice. That's a weird thing to say. Are you into burning things? What? No! I'm, I just meant that it feels peaceful here. Yeah. I'm not very good at conversations. You're fine. So, what's got you doing that... Yeah. So, what's got you doing red deadly rituals? Huh? Well, normally people who come here either have nothing to lose in their life anymore. Or they're just plain dumb and reckless. Which one are you? Dumb, probably. Hmm. So, what's your deal? You don't have to tell me if you don't wanna. But I'll just annoy you until you do. Or until you ditch me. Doesn't make sense to ditch you yet. Yet? Alright. Alright? I suppose I can tell you, but it's going to get long. I have nothing better to do. How should I put this? There's something very wrong with me. But it sounds ridiculous when I say it out loud. I'm all ears. It's possible I may be possessed. No, I'm definitely either possessed or cursed. It's been like this since I was little. Back then I used to think I have a black cloud that just follows me everywhere. It makes people run away from me. It makes them hate me. They always have this terrifying look when they look at me. Sometimes it turns into hate, hatred or anger. With animals, it's even worse. Dogs will bark at me, and I can't even get a close, and I can't even get close enough to pet, to pet a cat. Or today, I tried buying something at the store and failed horribly. I hate that I can't even do something as simple as that. It's like just being around me makes people tense and aggressive. But I know for a fact that it wasn't always like this. I have memories of my childhood where things were fine. Something must have changed at some point. And then, everyone suddenly started acting differently differently with me. For a really long time, I thought it was my fault. I thought that maybe I'm just broken and different. I thought I did something wrong. I thought people had a reason to hate me so much. I know better now, but that doesn't change how it feels. This thing inside me, whatever it is, it's isolating me from everyone. Even my parents hate being around me. They leave the house for weeks at a time and make excuses if I ask to come along. My brother is the only one who's there for me every time. And I know how hard it is for him, but somehow he never falters. Without him, I... I've been trying to get better for so long. So, this ritual is, well, my last hope. If I fail to find answers, then I'll probably give up on everything. I can't bear to live like this anymore. Still, you should not about this. 
You've been around me. Don't you feel it? Huh. Let me see. That's cute. Hmm. Yeah, you're right. You got this weird ominous aura. Feels dangerous. Doesn't bother me. Really? Nah, I guess I felt worse. That doesn't make any sense. There must be something wrong with you. Is this person not human? Heh, <laughs> says the possessed girl. Rune said possessions weren't a thing, so it might be a curse. But you don't buy it? So what? You came here to get exercised? I've tried that already. I wouldn't have come here unless I exhausted my possibilities beforehand. Smart. No dice then? Nothing. That sucks. Have you tried throwing table salt at yourself? <laughs> I hear it wards off demons. It might get rid of your curse too. Very funny. <laughs> you seem to know quite a lot about this place and the rituals. Uh, yeah, I did a lot of those rituals to kill time. What? I'm surprised you're not dead yet. No, they say, idiots don't die. I don't think anybody says that. <laughs> Maybe you could start saying it then. So... Is your curse the reason you're trying to find a lighthouse? Yes. I was told there is someone there who can help me who can help guide me. Do you hear that? Yes. Guests? But not invited. I'm confused. Uh oh. Fire? Fire! Make it stop! Hmm? A smell? Lilith? No. No, no. No, 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 no. Not you again. Get out! Get out, 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 get out. Oh boy. Well, I'm really screwed now. Even if I wake up from here, what can I even do? Let's see... A monster just put me in a cage and will probably eat me or something. Even so, it's not like I can stay here. This place is useless. Let's find the exit and see what happens. It's smaller than mine, but it's always cold. Alright. Can I go backwards? I don't think I can. Passageway is closed behind you. There she is. That's her. She's so cursed that the poor bird dropped dead. If she can make a bird die, I wonder what she could do to people. What a freak. Hey, you killed that poor bird. N no It flew into the window next to your seat. But I didn't. It died because of you. This is your fault. Hey, where do you think you're going?
<sighs> this isn't my fault. I can't believe you're still acting innocent. You disgust me. You cause nothing but ruin everywhere you go. I, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry. I don't do it on purpose. I didn't do anything. Maybe you should do something. Huh? To make it up to us. Why don't you take responsibility for messing up everything? Uh, how? Hmm. Make her eat it. Yeah, eat the bird. What? You heard them. Eat it, witch. If you eat it, maybe we'll forgive you. Eat the bird, murderer. Eat it, witch. Sorry, I can't let you pass. Please? Just do what they say. This isn't real. Do I really have to do this? Do not. Take the knife. Stab self. This dream. The easiest way to get out. It's obvious, isn't it? Ah, it hurts. It hurts. When am I waking up? Let this stupid nightmare end. Why? It's just a dream. So why? It hurts. That's not how you wake up in this game. Well, thought that would be an ending, but all right. Yes, yes, I already know this. Take the knife. Don't stab. Alright, can't you pass? Please just do what they say. How about no? Wait, what are you doing? I'm doing something, unlike you. Ah! She killed him! Oh my god, she's crazy! Murderer! 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 Murderer. There's nothing else to do here. Yes, there is. Don't lie to me. Pick up red item three, of course. She can't run anymore. And close behind you. All right. A strong force prevents you from entering the wardrobe. To push through? No. I bet there's something here. Somewhere. There's gotta be an ending, I think. Surely. Surely there's an ending, or some sort of easter egg. I guess push through it. Oh. I'm out of my cage? He's still trapped though. Oh, all my items are gone. Without that doorknob, I can't go back home. Escape Miss, Miss Knives' cage. The cage we're trapped in. It's closed from all sides, so it's impossible to get inside. Let's be careful so I don't end up back in there. 
A small cage housing a crow. How cruel. Locking up a bird like this. Or is it just a regular pet? Good job getting out of that. I didn't get to see what you did, but you must be really good at passing through solid steel bars. Thanks. Looks like you're in a bind yourself. If he was a demon, he could have used his powers to escape, right? Or maybe he just doesn't care. Listen, you probably shouldn't stay here. If that monster lady hears the noise you made and comes to check, you'll be in trouble, you know? Hmm, you're right. Well, see you. Where are you going? I'm going to look around for a bit. And? I should try and find an exit too. And nothing else? Are you serious? Get me out of here! Ah, oh, of course. Sure, I'll try. Alright. <laughs> I lost all my items. Do you still have your belongings? My stuff? It's all gone. I guess the demon lady took it. I see. That's really bad. I can't go back home without my things. Well, see you later. Got it. Where do you get the lollipop? If you want a lollipop, I have more. No, thank you. Weren't your, wasn't your stuff taken? Be careful out there. A large cage hang from, hangs from the ceiling. A large cage. Wait. Hmm? What did you try to buy? What? You said you tried to buy something at the store today. Why are you asking this now of all times? Just curious. It was just some macarons. Huh. So you like macarons? They're great. Is this really the time to have this discussion? When else? I'm bored now, not later. It's not like I have much to think about in this cage. I'm leaving. Wait, at least tell me your name and I'll leave you in peace. <sighs> it's Lacey. Huh. Will that be all? Yeah. I'll be going then. Good luck. Try not to get killed. Mm hmm. I'm not sure where I am right now. But all I have to do is find the exit without running into that monster. Or should I help that guy first? It's locked. Of course it is. Then I want to find the entrance. Portrait of a person with a brain for a head. Painting that's mostly yellow. Touch it? Yes. Bunch of yellow powder sticks to your finger. You wipe it off. Various strange portraits adorn the walls. Portrait of a girl with horns growing out of her face. Portrait of a grandma. She looks nice, maybe. A portrait of a person with knives floating above their head. A portrait of a person with a heart for a head. A portrait of a person with a crow for a head. It looks... It looks nothing like those cute crows I've been seeing around. Portrait of a happy looking girl. Portrait of a person with a goat with, with a goat for a head. Uh can't talk to the long neck. A portrait of a scary looking person. A portrait of a person with a gaping mouth. What that mouth do? What that mouth do? I don't like this one. A portrait of a pretty pretty looking lady. She looks like she's made of porcelain. Painting that's mostly just red. Touch it. Bunch of red powder sticks to your finger. You wipe it off. Portrait of a person with an animal skull for a head. Portrait of a person with an animal skull for a head again. They're, they're both an animal skull, I guess. A portrait of a person with many eyes. I only really see two or three.
Um, that's... Death, right? Large painting seems to be missing both eyes. No, it, it, no, it isn't. Right, I need to fill up those eyes. Psst. Over here. Oh, a human. I see. Strange. How did you make it all the way here? Um, well, no matter. This isn't ideal, but it'll do, I suppose. Who are you? I do not have a name. What was that? Miss Knives is roaming around. Miss Knives? I think I met her. Yes, I saw that. You really brought out the crazy in her. I didn't exactly do anything. I need to find a way out of this place. I'm looking for a cursed door. Of course. We have a common goal. To avoid you wandering aimlessly until you get killed. I'll help you. Alright. So, why don't you have a name? You don't have a name? I wasn't given one. But when you live a solitary life, you don't need a name. You're free to call me what you wish. You humans seem to know... Seem to want to name everything. I'll call you Spider. That's a terrible name. Do you call other humans human? So, how do I get out of here? There are several strange ob uh, uh, objects scattered around this place. After you find them, you'll need to figure out how to unseal them. How will I know what I'm looking for? You'll know when you see it. Okay. By the way, I came in here with a lot of things, but they're all gone. If I don't get them back, don't worry, you'll have them if you get out of here. I hear her coming. You need to hide. Huh? Go now. Broken pot where the spider was. Virtual person with horns. Creepy portraits adorn the wall. Portrait of a girl with very long nails. Portrait of a girl with very long nails. Yes, I know. A portrait of a scary lady. There's a grinning person above it. Both look unsettling. A portrait of a person with an octopus plush for a head. Portrait of several characters with big, with big eyes. Portrait of a person with flowers for eyes. Portrait of a person with blood running down their face. Can they see properly? Portrait of a person with one eye. Portrait of a person with a butterfly on their face. Is the butterfly a part of their face or just resting on it? Good question. Lacey asking the real question. Alright, we're back at the beginning, I think. Oh. The door is gone. A bathtub filled with a black liquid. It's so big. You could fit, like, four of me in there. Check if there's anything useful inside. Wait, I think that kills me, right? Or, no? No, it doesn't. A tin key. A little cactus. Pink flowers in the vase. A shelf. Not nothing of interest. Okay. A shelf. Nothing of interest. Okay. A bathtub filled with a black liquid. A beautiful night sky. Three moons? They're probably fake. We're underground. It looks like some sort of stew. It's cold and doesn't seem to have been looked after in a long time. Stir it up? Yes. I think this kills me though. I can't remember what kills and what doesn't, but... Oh. The fourth blessing. Y you. What did you do to his leg? There's a black thing sticking out from the stew. Take it with you? Yes. 
It seems to be part of something bigger. You can't take all of it. Alright. Uh, wait. Huh? Oh. Right, I forgot about this. Does this box go? I seem to not remember. Um, a cookie jar. There's something inside that doesn't belong. Take it. Yes. A paint eyeball. A green frog. Wait, the eyeball goes. Hey, Christian. How you doing? Right. I can't remember what I did in the demo, but oh, hey. Oh, I remember this part. This part was- this part sucked. The first blessing. What I saw in the mirror was uglier than I hoped. There seems to be something strange inside the cage. Try to get the black object? I- Oh, okay, well. Well. Never mind. The room where you were locked in is directly under you. You can see Sai from here. He doesn't seem to be doing anything. Empty bird cages. Empty bird cages. Empty bird cages. Alright. Some, ab some abstract paintings. A painting of a lady. Her golden eye stands out. Pull it out. Obtain the eyeball. can do it the way back has turned into a wall son of a bitch okay well uh that happened try again don't give me the option to skip Are you mad even though i don't remember how to do this part at all so Yeah, this is gonna be tricky. I remember when I played the demo, this took way too long. The music is good though. I don't think I can make it. Yes! Oh my god. Ugh. I barely got away. I need to be more careful with the things I touch. The painting lady is gone. Some abstract paintings. I am surprised I got that second try. Anyway, I got both eyeballs now, so that means I can... Go here and... Put both, both eyes. Enter the painting? Sure. Wait, actually. Yes, it is him. Someone inside the snake with black knives all over their body. The fifth blessing. There are so many things a knife can cut through. Pull out black knife? Yes. When you pulled out a knife, the rest the rest of them crumbled apart. Yep. This is the same demon that was in uh Project Cat at the very beginning. Someone is tied to tied to the stake.
This is the same demo. The broken pot where Spider was. Right, I checked that one. It's locked. You can hear some singing on the other side. Wait, no. Um, I didn't check down here, actually. Yeah. An old gramophone. Various useless trinket... Trinklet... Tr trinkets... Are displayed on the, on these shelves. Oh my god. A, rot a, a, a rotary phone. It's old, but there's a certain charm to it. There's no dial tone. Purple flowers in a vase. Cool. A teapot full of some liquid. Seems to be water. A fireplace. There's no fire, so it's just a place. A tall, pretty plant. I don't have a lighter, and I probably shouldn't light it. A plant with a ta tag attached. It says, requires dim light. For enrichment, give it a flower crown once a month. Okay. An empty pot. A plant with a tag with a tag attached. Why is the word why are the two words tag and attached so fucking hard to say like right after the other? It says requires a medium light. Provide alcohol twice a twice daily to keep its leaves moist. Water is a valid substitute, as it carries, as it can tell the difference. Good to see your heart still beating. Uh, I'm not happy about it, but all right. Where is you? Oh yeah, check that. Plan of a tag attached. It says requires dim light. Feed it once a day to avoid irritability. Appropriate diet includes meat of various kinds. A plan of attack attached it says requires medium light. For enrichment, provide music. I mean, the music is here. What to do? Play music. A far... No, a place. A floor lamp. I can't turn it on. Um, right, um, oh, hey, you're back. Any clues? Yeah, I spoke to a spider. You spoke to a spider. And did the spider speak back? Yes. Okay, that's kind of intriguing. He told me what to do to get out of here. Really? Yes, I'll take care of it. All right. I'll just be here. It's locked. It's locked. I have a key. A key for something. A bookshelf housing hundreds of books. A bookshelf. Okay, one of them stands out. Read the passage. The 36th experiment has failed as well. I'm telling you, she's practically just a used tissue. Useless. Useless demon. We're wasting our time. Calm down. I can't work when you're so no noisy. Go play with your other dolls. Maybe I will. A bookshelf housing hundreds of books. One of them stands out. Read the passage. Are you upset? No, of course not. You look like you're deep in thought. You are the one who did this to her after all. Glenn, back off. Huh. If I'm correct, you're getting yourself into a messy situation. I'll be fine. Um... There's an eyeball inside the lamp, but you no longer need it. Oh, well. A pile of books taller than you. A reading table. A pile of books short, 
shorter than you. A bookshelf housing hundreds of books. One of them stands out. Alright, let's see. I don't think you should be testing on her anymore. Her powers hold potential. I wish to entertain this idea a little longer. She's incapable of any sort of coherent thought. We're just wasting our souls on her. What about this bookshelf? Housing hundreds of books. Hundreds of books. A pile of books shorter than you. A pile of books taller than you. Way taller. Taller than you. A pile of books taller than you. A massive pile of books. If they fell on you, it would hurt. Make them fall. What to do with a knife? Cut myself. Obtain knife. Oh, well. A knife. Alright. Massive pile of books. If they fell on you, it would hurt. A bookshelf housing hundreds of books. Um, did I interact with this bookshelf? I think I did, didn't I? I don't think you should be testing on her anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I don't want to read a passage. Okay. A bookshelf housing hundreds of books. One of them sends out, of course. I don't know why I've decided to talk to you. Maybe it's because you look really pitiful. You're so worthless that no matter what test they put, they put you through, you failed them all. If I just had left you alone that day, you wouldn't be wasting all, all of our time. You wouldn't be wasting your own time here. Tomorrow, Glenn will discontinue our tests. You better thank me. I'm the one who told him to. I'm just sick of seeing you. I have books taller than you. Okay. It's locked. Is this key? Oh, key fits. What's this? The third blessing. Water provides the best healing. There's some kind of black rag here. Take the black object? Yes. An oversized bed. This bed is too large, even for that demon. There's a box on top of the vanity table. Uses a combination lock. There's a drawing of a key on the box. Try to unlock the box. Box remains locked. A painting of a window. A simple coat hanger. A small bedside table. It's clearly too small, especially for this bed. Painting of a window. A large basket filled with toys. What is all this? Mm -hmm. Be careful out there. Um, hold on. For water, there is this. No? Never mind. This is also technically water. Uh, the black thing. Take it with you? I can't. Cutting board. Um. It's locked. You can hear someone singing on the other side. Oh, right. I can get this now. The first blessing. What I saw in the mirror is, was uglier than I had hoped. There seems to be something strange inside the cage. Try to get black object? Yes. This is a mirror, isn't it? It was like wooden glass. You inspect the object closely. As you look into the mirror, the mirror regains its colors. Okay, what about this? No, not this. 
Um, I did say something about water. Not this. Um, it's locked. Um, what do I do? Go to size bed. Um, I need to keep, I need to think for this. Uh, wait, water, right? This. You pour some liquid onto the rag. Obtained cold compress. All right. So, what's this? A warning sign. It doesn't say what the warning is for. A place. Um, okay. Do nothing. Uh, oh, one of them needed music. Was it this one? Thank you. Oh. Okay, so that's one. It says requires dim light. Okay. Dim light. A floor lamp. This doesn't do anything. Mm. Requires dim light. Requires medium light. Um. I guess I could use this. Bring water to the plant? Yes. Thank you. Okay. So I guess the light isn't necessary. For enrichment, give it a flower once a month. Uh, I think this? Purple flowers in waste. I could use these flowers. Yes. Thank you. Uh... Requires them light, feed it once a day to avoid irritability. A perfect diet includes meat of various kinds. You could eat me. I'm I'm delicious. Um meat of any kind. Uh I mean the eyeballs could have worked. If I want to look for meat, it's probably over here. Oh the frog. What is this box for? Storage compartment filled with various types of food. A green frog. Maybe I could feed this to the plant. Bring the frog to the plant. I'm sorry, little guy. Poor little guy. Thank you. There we go. Take a lockpick? Yes. Various useless trinkets are displayed on these shelves. Okay, so I got the lockpick. It's locked. You can hear someone singing on the other side. Uh, the door has no keyhole. Great. Alright. Then I guess it's for the box. Oh, right. I can... Right. I can lockpick him, I think. But I also think it's funny if I just leave him there. And just get out without helping him. You don't know how to use it. Okay, well, guess we have to. No, well, it was it was fun while it lasted. Be careful out there. Uh, I have a lockpick. I found this, but I don't know how to use it. Can you pick your own lock or something? Sure can. Sai, join your party. Free sign from Miss Knives' cage. What if I, like, no reason? Alright. Alright, let's save. There doesn't seem to be any way to free the bird. Poor guy. Poor bird. It's almost St. Patrick's Day. Ooh, nice. 
What do people do in St. Patrick's Day? Do you think you can handle this? Easy peasy. Oh, it really is easy. Hold on. Means he has some Irish? Hmm. Psst. Over here. Here, on the wall. Spider? Yes. Is that really you? Huh. You really meant it when you said you talked to a spider. You looked different last time, but it's still basically a spider. Oh, there's two of you now. Well, no matter. Miss Knives discovered my hiding spot. She's not fond of my presence. So she turned me into this. It's pathetic. Damn. She must have crazy powers. Not quite. You both must have had some time to look around this place by now. Did you figure out anything strange? You mean aside from everything? Kind of a tall order, pal. Well... Location of this house is strange. Maybe humans are just slow. None of what you're seeing is real. Huh? Miss Knives is a strange case. She created this place out of her own desires. But the house doesn't actually exist. Convenient. So then, it's an illusion? To an extent, yes. That's also why I look like this. Miss Knives only sees what she wants to see. So she sees you as a little spider on the wall? It would seem so. I see. Then to escape, you have to break the illusion. Remind her who she is, or rather, who she isn't. That's where those objects you need to collect come into play. They seem to have some sort of connection to her memories. Once you find and unseal them all, come back and see me. Bookshelf full of coloring books and other children's books. Bookshelf full of books about painting. One of them stands out. Read the passage? Yes. Should a merchant not be able... Should a merchant not be available in your region, it is always possible to create your own paint by mixing pigments with water. Take glass jar? Yes. Painting with two protruding hands expecting something. Looks like I can place something on these hands. A small pool. The water looks clean. Uh, I remember there was some guy here during one of your intermissions saying vulgar stuff. Oh, you mean last stream? Oh, yeah, there was a dude that was basically like, uh, I think he was like, what? Uh, he was making like sex jokes, but honestly, I found them funny, so like, I, I just left them there. <laughs> Spider is just dang dangling there. Yeah, that one. Yeah. I found it funny, to be fair, so I didn't really care. <laughs> a crow stands at the edge of the pool. Thank you, crow. Crow Hogan. There's something covered with a drape. Remove the drape? Yes. The second blessing. You always said you wanted to try watercolor. I believe in you. I know. Looks like a flat black square. Take it with you? Yes. It's too large and heavy to carry around. Okay. But I do remember. Um, so. Yellow paint. Red paint. And... paint yeah this I I was embarrassed when I found out that this was uh, this was this simple <laughs> um also no the crow is dead no <laughs> not the crow ah oh, crap the knives lady must have been in here how do you know well, in my experience, birds don't just combust. Fair. Oh, 
A large basket filled with toys. There's a box on top of the vanity table. These are the combination box. There's a drawing of a key inside uh, on the box. Try to unlock the box. Um, I have no idea. The box remains locked. Uh, drawing of a key inside the box. What did I do to open that? If I did open it. Is there a painting? Yes. Someone is tied to the stake. So, Sai, you're not gonna say anything about it? No? Alright. Broken pot with spider woods. Um, there's a black thing that's sticking out from the stew. Take it with you. Uh, you may part of something bigger, you can take all of it. I can. Can I cut through that? No. Um. What do I do with this box again? Unless. Was it something I take outside? No. Locked. You can hear someone singing from the other side. The door has no key on. Uh, oh, right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I'm an idiot. <laughs> I am a moron. I forgot about the paint. But also, uh, where am I going? Here, alright. Uh, do the crows always have green eyes? With your masterpiece complete, the canvas turns into a sketchbook. Okay, I got four of the objects. I know that I have to give them to this, but I first want to get the other... It's already wet enough. Okay. I want to get the other um, thingy. The other item first, because I remember this was like had like D4. This house is way too fucking big. Um, simple coat hanger. I swear I've probably sat on every chair ever. Mm -hmm. Oh, pretty poor. Um, there's nothing here. It's no use. It's just a wall now. A coat hanger. Purple flower vase. So a guest book. It has no signatures. Vase with a single flower. Hmm. A 
Okay, where is the last thing? This is like a leg, isn't it? From what I remember. Cookie jar. Whoa, neat. Can I have one? There was an eyeball in there. Ah, uh, so no cookie? I don't think you should eat that. Bummer. <laughs> There's a key in there as well. Oh my god, you fucking asshole. <sighs> Belonging to a padlock or something similar. It was there the whole time. Fucking hell. Okay. Also, I went the wrong way, didn't I? Or... No. No, no, no. Just the right way. That's not it? That's not it. Alright. A key belonging to a padlock. Uh... We're just back to square one. Um, this has no keyhole. Yeah. So... It's not this, it can't be. So yeah. <laughs> um... Can't be in here. A padlock. Did I see a padlock anywhere? Like it's a really small key. Unless it's for the cage. No. something in these hands all right fine I'll, I'll just I'll throw some some things in here after the incident but with that boy's leg the authorities knocked at our door again your daughter is a witch they said to my father they talked about how I, how I hurt that boy and how my mother healed from a fatal illness how my eyesight came back. They told us both me and my father are accused of witchcraft. I started with the wrong thing, but all right. That's nonsense, what are you talking about? The whole family needs to be cleansed. Your daughter will be tried for witchcraft. And due to your ties to her, you will be as well. Hold on, wait, you've got it all wrong. She's not my daughter. I merely found her on the streets. She does not share my blood. Father. Take him. N no, please, I have nothing to do with this. When the men walked in the house, my father ran towards the back door. He was frantically bumping into the furniture to reach it. Find the girl and burn his body. Burn the whole house down, it's cursed. My father's blood ran down the hallway like a small river stream. It, sep yeah, it seeped into the cracks of the broken floorboards. This is all that boy's fault. The prison cell was cold and dark. There was nobody else there with me, except for the occasional rat. The best friends anyone could have. People always said rats are dirty and dangerous. But at that moment, I appreciated the company. The adults told me my execution will be at, will be the following morning. 
They said I will be burned in order to purify the village. What does that even mean, purify the village? I was alone in my thoughts for what they for what felt like hours before someone came by. Hey, Iris, will I get out of here? Um, listen, I'm so sorry. I I told my dad about everything. What? No way. I thought if you might really be a witch, he could protect you. Because he knew we were friends. I'm sorry I did this. I didn't know he would kill your dad and and you. Please. Please take this knife. Please use it before they kill you. You'll be better off if you end it this way. What's happening? Why would she tell me something like this? What's going on? I love you and father said burning is slow and painful. You're better off doing it this way. You're asking me to kill myself? Yes, because I still care about you. Is this what you call care? I didn't know that my vision would get blurry if I cry. I still have the knife. My life is below average. I've been blind since I was a baby, so my parents thought of abandoning me. A blind child cannot help the family, they said, especially not a girl. But my mother said they loved me so much that they wanted to give me a chance. Right now, I manage just fine. I do my chores, I go to the market, I help with the vegetable garden. My mother is sick, so she's always in bed. The doctor says she might be like this for the rest of her life. Every day I go meet my friend at the riverbank. Iris is always talking excitedly about everything you could find outside the village. She makes the world sound so bright. We made a deal that when we turn 14, we'll run away together and travel to the mountain, to the mountains and seas. But I was actually fine with a simple life. The bare minimum was enough. As long as I had Iris. If there's one thing I wanted, it was just to be able to see her. The first blessing changed the course of my life. I couldn't calm my breathing. I woke up one morning and I could see. I saw shapes and colors in my parents. I saw the broken dining table. I saw the weeds in the vegetable garden. I saw the chipped cup that I drank from. That I drank from. I saw my wrinkled clothes. Despite not having much. They were the most beautiful things I laid my eyes on. I couldn't say the same about my reflection. Have I always looked like this? Were my eyes always so blind? Bland? Jesus Christ, talking is becoming more and more difficult as the stream goes. Was my hair always so dull? My parents gradually grew distant. People in the village stared, stared at me and whispered behind my back. Why did they seem so scared of me? Iris said she's a little nervous around me, but she was really happy that I got my eyesight. She called it a miracle. My parents started avoiding me. When I spoke to them, they always tried to brushed me away. The only times their tired eyes met mine, I only saw hatred in them. They always look at me this way. The second blessing came as a gift. I always met Iris out, of, out, out by the river, and we sat and talked for hours. She told me all about the things I couldn't see, but it was different now. She spoke with such happiness and excitement, I couldn't take my eyes off her. Okay, so I just had to check if the audio was still there.
so to celebrate this miracle, I got you something. What? For me? Of course. Your eyes work now. It's amazing. We have to celebrate. So, I stole this from my family. But shh, don't tell. What? Iris, a sketchbook and paints are so expensive. How? Why? You always said you wanted to paint. I believe in you. I'm so excited to see what you'll come up with. I couldn't believe it. My very own sketchbook and watercolors. There were so many things I could paint. Mother was always bedridden, so I made a habit of showing her my paintings. I started with trees and objects, but I took a liking to portraits of people. They all have such distinct, beautiful faces. After only two days, I had already made eight portraits. But when I flipped to the next page, a different kind of portrait filled the brown, pa filled the brown paper. It was all painted in black, and it was twisted and scary. I hadn't painted like this. I didn't even know this who this person or creature was. Every morning after that, I found new distorted portraits in the pages, but I never remembered painting them. My mother got worse one day. Father thinks she might die. I don't want mom to die. I brought her a cold compress to lower the fever. Mom always said that water provides the best healing. That night, I said a prayer to try and help her. I wish for her to get better, and I wish... Oh my god, I need tea. I wish for her to get better, and I wish for our family to go back to normal at least. The third blessing came as a surprise to everyone in the village. The morning after my prayer, my mother was out of bed and cooking. She said she felt much better. She even had strength to go to the market. You see? The cold compress did the job. Clean water is the purest thing we have. Are you sure you should be out of bed? This is the best I've felt in years. But the doctor said... I'm sure he was just wrong. You know, medicine isn't always entirely accurate. No more than two days later, some adults knocked at the door. They took my mother. They called her a witch. They claimed she used her powers to get cured of a deadly illness. And they said the village needs to be cleansed and that witch hunts were important for this the next day my mother was burned at the stake everyone watched and everyone cheered as she died slowly for a sin she did not commit this was the first time I wished that I couldn't see anymore and Let's redo the knife because I I did that one first, even though it was the last I should have done. After the incident, that oh, never mind. No, that's that's no, never mind. Nope. There was another one. God damn it! Nope. 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 Go back. Shut up. Shut the fuck up. No. No. Oi. I've already no. Stop. Stop! How do I skip this? Shut up. Go back. Just let's find a way to get that fucking leg. Um. Spoiling the game within the game. That's amazing. Um, fun. I guess I can cut the leg with. I I tried to cut the leg with the knife, didn't I? 
That's just not really possible? Yes. Can't take all of it. Then cut it, you fucked art. Oh. It just didn't register, I guess, the first time. Like, I guess I wasn't close enough because apparently that matters. Human foot. I swear I did that. Someone go back and check. I know I did it. The first time. No. Human foot. A foot that used to belong to someone. The fourth blessing was something I would never wish for. Give it back. How'd you get your hands on such an expen an expensive looking sketchbook, huh? Let's see. Stop. Just give it to me. What the heck is this? They flipped through the pages of my sketchbook and their faces got an awful ghostly white. Is she a witch? What are those? I didn't draw that. Hey, I didn't know you were a witch. I'm not. Pages and pages of creepy drawings. What is this? Some kind of curse casting shit? I didn't make them. I don't know where they came from. It's the truth. Why didn't they believe me? Stop, what are you doing? You're just a filthy witch. I'm reporting you. You won't be needing this. Please don't break it. You don't even need all these colors. Nothing but black. You were never supposed to see anything but darkness anyway, blind freak. Please stop, give them back. Aw, oh, poor little crybaby. I'm gonna report you. Father will be so proud I caught my own witch. I'm not a witch. I swear I'm not. No, don't. Please. Stop. Please stop. Please stop. What did I do to you? Please stop. I hate them. I hate my life. Why is this happening to me? Soon enough, the boy dropped the sketchbooks. My eyes were focused on the crumpled pages of my sketchbook hitting the ground, so I didn't see it until someone screamed. Ah! The boy's right leg twisted almost 360 degrees as if it was some form of nightmarish witchcraft. Then it twisted again. Something broke in his leg and he fell down, writhing in pain. I couldn't understand what I was seeing. You, what did you do to his leg? Nothing, I didn't even touch him. Ah, it hurts. Call someone. We need help. Help. You're a witch. You're a witch. I will destroy you. You'll be burnt. Burn in hell. The adults came and took him away. When I finally lifted my, ga my gaze from the dirt below my fingers, Iris was standing in front of me. My heart sank. Did she see what happened? Uh, are you alright? I... You didn't do that to his leg, right? No, of course I didn't. Uh, okay. I... Why are you here? Um, I came because my parents said that I'm not allowed to see you anymore. And then the knife. After the incident with that boy's leg, the authorities knocked at our door again. Your daughter is a witch, they said to my father. They talked about how I hurt that boy and my mother healed from a fatal illness and how my eyesight came back. They told us both me and my father are accused of witchcraft. That's nonsense, what are you talking about? The whole family needs to be cleansed. Your daughter will be tried for witchcraft and due to your ties to her, you will be as well. Hold on, wait, you've got it all wrong, she's not my daughter. I merrily found her on the streets, she does not share my blood. Father, take him, take him, 
No, please. I have nothing to do with this. When the men walked in the house, my father came back. Uh, my father ran towards the back door. He was frantically bumping into the furniture to reach it. Find the girl and burn his body. Burn the whole house, it's cursed. My father's blood ran down the hallway like a small river stream. It seeped into the cracks of the wooden of the broken floorboards. This is all that boy's fault. The prison cell was cold and dark. There was nobody else with me except for the occasional rat. People always said rats are dirty and dangerous, but at that moment, I appreciated the company. The adults told me my execution will be the following morning. They said I will be burned in order to purify the village. What does that even mean, purify the village? I was alone with my thoughts for what felt like hours before someone came by. Hey, Iris? Will I get out of here? Um, listen, I'm so sorry. I... I told my dad about everything. What? No way. I... I thought... If you might really be a witch, he could protect you. Because he knew we were friends. I'm sorry I did this. I didn't know he would kill your dad and... And you. Please. Please take this knife. Please use it before they kill you. You'll be better off if you end it this way. What's happening? Why would she tell me something like this? What's going on? I love you and... Father said burning is slow and painful. You're better off doing it this way. You're asking me to kill myself? Y yes, because I still care about you. Is this what you call care? I didn't know that my vision would get blurry if I cry. A small pool, the water looks clean. You're done! Good work! What now? Now, all of these objects need to be burned in the correct order. What's the order? That's for you to figure out. The ha uh... The hands over there might provide a clue. I see. Make sure you have a way to light the fireplace as well. Oh, that's true. Are there any places I haven't checked yet? Lastly, the whole thing tends to culminate with candles going out. Therefore, if you see any candles, put them out. Understood. Okay. Oh. The candles are already out. The There's no music anywhere. Wow, just no music at all. Well, hey. No, nothing? What if I enter the painting? I think I tried... Um... Hey there. The burnt doll blocks your path. I'm sorry. You know, uh... You know, man. I, I, um... Yeah, you know, I you, you saw nothing, right? Uh I was uh I was just minding, you know, my own business. Oh, yeah. Um Yeah, you know. You you I loved you in Pocket Mirror, uh, not Pocket Mirror. What the fuck? I loved you in Par Project Cat, you know? <laughs> yeah, you had a cool intro, you know? All right, bye. Okay. Um Oh, wow. That's good. That's 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 nice. It's dead, like my dreams. It's dead, like my soul. All right, a fireplace. I don't have anything to burn, to burn it with. Oh, it's locked. You can hear someone crying inside. 
Oh, well, hello. Oh. Oh, well, that, you know. Oh, that was, uh, that was nice. Wow, yeah. Not gonna show up? Alright, sure. Oh, we can walk in here. Well, hey, I don't remember any of this. Various paintings of a young girl stored here. Wait, wait, wait. Before I continue, I want to go back because I want to explore whatever else is here. Uh, nothing in the cages. Poor, poor crow. Anything in the bedroom? No. Um. Wait. A vanity table. The drawers are filled with several cosmetics. Wait, I can't. I can't interact with the with the box anymore. No. What was the combination? Damn it. All right. Well, it's too late for that now. Was there any sort of hint at the combination? Oh. Uh. Oh, I see. Um, the first one was the mirror. The second, the sketchbook. The third is the the cloth. The fo excuse me. The foot. And the knife. There we go. And then the fire. Obtained lighter. My hands are charred. Alright. I don't remember doing this in the demo. Maybe it's... Oh. That's nice. The paintings have been destroyed. Nice. Oh, everything has been destroyed. Oh, wow. Oh. <laughs> Creepy portraits adorn the wall. Oh, but not the thingies. What if I go upstairs now? I just, I gotta see this now. Still there? Burnt all blocks your path. Man. You gonna do anything? Attack me? Tell me I'm an idiot. Be impressed. I don't know. Oh, wait. These are the same. Aw. That's unfortunate. Alright. Well, then. Light the fireplace. Yes. What should I burn first? They have to be in a specific order. So the mirror. Wait, actually. What should I burn next? The knife. That kills, right? That that should be a bad ending. And finally, the cold compress. This illusion should break apart now, shouldn't it? Too bad. I was starting to like this place. It should be a bad ending, I think. Because, yeah. That's probably not good. Did you see that? The, pa the painting opened its eyes. Um... Did you burn the things in the right order? I think so. Uh, no you didn't. I know you didn't, because I made sure you didn't. Was the illusion supposed to literally break apart? I don't know. Maybe we should leave. Oh crap, the doors are gone. Hey, be careful.
Oh, we're dead. That's fine. Uh, oh, wait. My foot, it hurts. Where are we? We need to find a way out. Yeah, well, about that. Oh. I might have landed on something hard. Doesn't look great. What do we do? You can still move? Go on ahead. I need a moment. Uh, okay. Uh, hey. You'll, uh, you'll come back, right? Yes. Thanks. Oh, and I can't run. I can't sprint. On. What if I... Can I talk to Sai? Are you sure you'll be okay? Yeah, for sure. Tip-top shape. Oh, hi. Oh! She's back. She's back. She's singing in my ears. Singing all the time. Humming. Burning. Oh no. Burning. <laughs> Burning. God damn. That end one of twelve. What's at stake? Ha <laughs> ha. Okay. Fun. Before I... There's something I want to check. What if I go back in here? One more thing, I couldn't help but notice how weak you look. The challenges ahead might be beyond your capabilities. There's an object there's an object inside my old hiding spot that can help with that. Just dangling there. It's wet enough. Take a look at the sketchbook. It's full of unsettling sketches. She's still pretty talented, though. I remember... I don't know if I have, like, Mandela Effect or some shit, but I remember there was, like, a death with that pool or something like that. Um, maybe I just remember wrong, but... Anyway, light the fireplace and now we'll do them in the correct order. So first, we burn the mirror. Then we burn the sketchbook. Then the compress. Then the foot. And finally, the knife. This illusion should break apart now, shouldn't it? Too bad. I was starting to like this place. Fire. Lilith. Again. How? But how? How? No, 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 no. No more. Die. Oh god, this fight. I remember this. Right? Yep.
Okay. I somehow survived this. How? Why can't you- Oh fuck. Every time I try to be at peace, you ruin everything. a hit. Ah, okay, well. That one, uh, that one was hard. Try again? I'm not skipping, fuck off. That is insulting to my intelligence. Oh, I... Okay, well that, that one was avoidable. I... I feel like I've heard this music somewhere. Like, I feel like it's like an actual song. Ah, that was a mistake. Okay. Well... We try. Wait, oh my god, okay, that one, that one was on me. I was not paying attention. Oh my... No, no you don't. Wait, no, fuck. Okay, well... Oopsie. Oh. So admittedly I could be playing this a little better, but where's the fun in that? See? So funny, isn't it? Death perception on this. Oh no. Oh. How did I dodge that? Okay. Well, here's your answer. Press the wrong button. Wait, oh no. I, I couldn't avoid that. I mean, I could have, but I it was like I didn't notice it until the last second. Okay. time man uh. I will never skip this Uh, 
Oh, okay, well. It's that part that keeps fucking me up. Wait, no. Okay, well. Okay, this is gonna take a while. I couldn't see the fucking thing under my feet. Oh my god. Well then. How many tries did it take me in the demo? I'm curious. Because I remember this took a while there as well. I don't know how I avoided that. How oh, am I so- Oh, help! Ooh, my jinx did the No, 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 no. I did it. I did it. Uh, no I didn't. Okay, um, I guess I gotta run. This was not in the demo before. I don't remember this being in the demo. Um, fun. Uh, I guess the mirror, right? We start there. This was not in the demo. I know for a fact it wasn't. Yeah, okay, I, I knew it. This has to be in order. Hold on. Uh... Then it was the sketchbook. Don't you dare touch me. Don't any of you touch me. Then this. No. No, 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 no. I'm pretty sure this. Took you so long you took a break and came back to try again? Huh. Okay, I don't have to restart from <laughs> from the from the knives thing. Um that's the fire. Uh there is the sketchbook. Then there is the thing here. What if I get them out of order? I should try that. If I die. If I die only. Uh, then it was the foot. 
Ow. Okay, that's fine. I can take damage. Then the knife. Come on. Shit. The knife part almost mentally killed your motivation. God damn. No, well, let's try getting them out of order. Wanna see. Okay, so it doesn't let me. Interesting. This sounds like the Lavender Town theme. <laughs> Ow, okay, well, that one could have been avoided. Um... Fuck, I went the wrong way. Oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, that one was... That one could not have been avoided. That, that, I was literally surrounded. And no, I'm not skipping this. I went the wrong way again. Directions, man! Directions are not my thing, apparently. Uh, sketchbook. This bed was a lot larger, wasn't it? <laughs> then the knife... That's not the right way! Where the fuck is the knife? There it is. Go, 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 go! Okay, well... Uh, I, I was looking at the guy, I could I was like, where's the candle? And then I, like, saw the guy, and like, I was like, oh. Which number I'm at. That was. <laughs> I wasn't close enough to put it out. Okay, now. Go over here. Okay, that's fine. I'm at the last one, please! That's fine. Wait, no, that's not fine. What do you mean? What the fuck do you mean? You got me fucked up. Also, the music changed. It went back to the to this one. Okay, well, now I know.
No, that's that was wrong. Okay. Um. God damn it. Oh god, I must have stood right under it. I mean, this pattern is pretty easy so far. It's just that it's probably the later ones that are gonna get like really disgusting. It's not good that I took damage in the exact same spot, but you know I can I can manage. This is now a damageless run. It's a bit late for that, but I mean. Oh gosh. What do you want from me? <laughs> Whoa, oh! Okay, this isn't too bad. This isn't this isn't bad at all. Yep. Yeah, okay. It it gets it gets uh really fast. Oh fuck you! That part isn't bad, but it's kind of annoying because it gets faster. That was wrong in, on every front. Yeah, you know, I might as well have died there. I, that was just not a good, a good try. I don't know how I didn't take damage. That was also a terrible try. That was so wrong. Oh no. I keep taking damage there. Oh. Shit. Well. That wasn't good. Um. Let's try this again. Okay. This is like a fucking seizure war. I should be giving a seizure warning here. I also did not think about the the fact that that thing was about to. I mean, at least this part of like this pattern here is not that bad. Like it's pretty easy to to cheese at. Like you don't need. Really I was too busy talking and I didn't even realize I was in danger. And I still somehow managed to be damageless. Okay. Ah, get out! Get out, 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 get out. I did it. That was awful. Where am I? There's a piece of paper on the floor. 
It's titled Sick Blessing. Do you want to read it? Of course. I was tied up in front of the whole village where Iris' father gave a speech. It was about bringing forth a new era, about cleansing impurities, about living in peace. Peace. I thought I already lived in peace. I thought I could keep living in peace next to Iris. Was she in that crowd too? Was she watching? Would she cry for me? It didn't matter anymore. I was only a sacrificial pawn in this bigger story. How did Mother feel standing here? Was she relieved to finally be rid of all this injustice? To finally start being at peace? It didn't matter. Mother and Father were dead. And now, this will be over for me too. The monster standing before me finished his speech. The crowd was cheering. They seemed to agree with his preach. He lit the firewood, and the heat was slowly embracing me. For a moment, it almost felt comforting. But that moment was brief. When the fire reached my legs, the pain became unbearable. The crowd's cheers were slowly drowned out by my own screams. Curse this. Curse this. It hurts. Why must I suffer? This isn't fair. Why won't anyone help me? It hurts so much. I hate them. I hate them. How could they cheer for this? How could they be so cruel? I wish they were all dead. I wish they, were, they would all suffer. I heard it once in a dream before. Six blessings from a curse. Was I cursed? Because at that moment, I received my sixth blessing. The fire spread incredibly fast in all directions, and the flames that had reached my thighs died out. Instead, the fire spread all around me. Everyone was screaming, terrified. Everyone was burning. What happened? Where's Iris? I used the knife she gave me to untie myself. It cut easily. I tried walking, but I couldn't even stand. My legs hurt. They hurt so bad. I looked around, but only saw fire. People were trying to run, but there was no escape. The floor, the houses, everything was on fire. The whole village was covered in a thick smoke. The only place the fire didn't reach was the ground I stood on. I can't move, but I need to make sure Iris is okay. Huh? Make sure Iris is okay? Why should I? It's all going to hell anyway. I sat on the floor, holding the knife. My miracle. Is this what came of my miracle? I never asked for this. All of this misfortune. It all started after I got my eyesight back. What are these eyes? I don't recognize them. I don't want them. I never wanted them, not like this. You can have them back. Do you hear me? These are not my eyes. I stabbed and stabbed. I was determined to remove them. After all, if I removed them, things would go back to normal. I could do my chores as usual. I could care for mother. I could spend my days with Iris. It felt so good. It felt so relieving. I stabbed until I stopped seeing. 
until I stopped worrying. Until I stopped feeling. Until I stopped moving. I think in my final moments, I laughed. I laughed at how my life turned out. Six blessings from a curse. Six blessings from a curse. Yes. Because cursed is the only way I can describe this pathetic life. the theme from earlier, except slow it down. Aw, poor Miss Knives. Defeat Miss Knives without skipping the battle. That's something I did back in the back in the demo. Welcome back. How long have I been out? 14 minutes. That's creepy. Shouldn't watch people sleep. I actually looked around first, I swear. The door is right down this hall, you see? I see. You're pretty crazy back there, you know? You must be really good at dodging knives. Thanks. You sure you're not a demon yourself? No. It was a joke, you know? So, is it a dead end? Yep. I see. Just as Rune said. You sound disappointed. Don't tell me you're up for more near-death experiences. I just haven't solved anything yet. I didn't find Red. I'm, I'm right here, by the way. I didn't even find the lighthouse. All of the things I set out to do. You've got time. You're not dead yet. That has to count for something, right? I guess there's no helping it. Uh, this wasn't here before. Oh. Is that Miss Knives? Is this what she actually looks like? Whoa. She looks like a used napkin. It looks like this gate could be open. Open it? Not yet. Fun. I'm gonna look around first. Oh. Right. You're... Spider? Good work back there. Didn't think you'd actually do it. It feels good to see this place again. How's this good? You're locked up. I don't need much to be content. My cell neighbor keeps me entertained. You mean Miss Knives? Are you surprised? Well, kind of. She's seen better days. But she'll be fine. She's just like a spider. After a little while, she'll make a new web and entangle everyone in it again. I'm curious to see what it will look like next time. Huh. I see. Besides, she does get a visitor every so often. Really? Yes. An intriguing one by the name of Red. Oh, hey, that's me. Don't look so excited. Red won't be back here anytime soon. No, I'm, 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 I'm right here. Yo. Yoo-hoo. <laughs> I see. Is Red the lighthouse person? Yes. Ah, damn. Interesting. If the lighthouse is what you're searching for, perhaps this is of use to you. Doorknob fragment. Is this a doorknob to the lighthouse? What well, remains of it? I see. Thank you. I appreciate it, even if it's broken. Then, consider our debts settled. 
spider seems at peace in this cell. It looks like this gate could be open, doesn't it? Sure. <laughs> no hard feelings. Your food, after all. Oh, I have to go through this whole fucking dialogue again. Will be open? Sure. She's crying. How long has she been locked up in there? I don't know. I'm sorry for disturbing you. A small toy. Crayons and children's drawings. A set of four toy plants. Crayons and children's drawings. An old crusty pillow. Crayons and children's drawings. Poor girl. Alright, let me grab this doorknob again. Before I go through there, let me go back here, over here, oh wait, this is the, yeah, this, oh, um, a dead primal, it's dead, good riddance, there's still to go further, it's completely flooded, okay, let's see if rune is still, a dead primal, another one? That makes two. What killed it? Was it Rune? A cursed Adam finds from the depths. <laughs> Best left forgotten. A dead primal. Are you sensing a pattern or is it just me? Really? What happened here? It must be my imagination. Oh. What's that? Wait, was that toy always there? What is it? A bear or something? It's a rabbit. Or that's what I think it's trying to be. It's an abomination. It's got no legs. Hey, um... And it's all mismatched. I don't think you should touch... Yeah. There you are. Finished cleaning yet? The hell you got in your mouth? Spit it out. Don't make me say it twice. Good girl. Wait, who is that? Ugh, the hell is this thing? Can't even tell anymore. You always make such a mess out, out of your food. Who is that? She's got a gun or something. I can't eat this crap. You can have it back. But hurry up, or I'm leaving without you. Hell, this place still gives me the creeps. Dead end 113. Stuffed animal. Huh. Doesn't make sense to go back this way. Let's go find that door instead. Not this way. Elevator door. All right, so it does. It doesn't really let us go anywhere else. Here it is. I suppose these cursed doors must be fairly common. Not that common, and 
they kind of suck. Sometimes you get stuck with no way to go back. I see. So it's a dead end after all. Since there's no doorknobs here. Looks like it. An empty slot. Place a doorknob, return doorknob. I guess it's finally time to use this. A garden with a single door in the middle. This is it. I just need to make a lily and place it in the vase, right? Hey, um... Before that... I wanted to talk to you about something. It's about that list. What list? Your to-do list? Before you die? Oh, that. I was thinking about it. Why don't you make a new list? Instead of a list to, a list of things to do before you die, why don't you make a list of things to do once you get fixed? Starting with treating me with, to some macarons. That way you'll have something to look forward to. I'm not sure what to say in a situation like this. You don't need to say anything. I just think it would suck if you gave up. Why? Why? Well, because, I don't know, today was fun. Fun? Yeah, everything was really exciting, don't you think? We almost died. Yeah, a lot. Yeah, but we made it, didn't we? I guess that's true. Anyways, let's hurry. It's not good to stay in this room for too long. Oh, we can go back. Alright then. First, to take the real lily from the vase. Now to make a paper lily from my letter. And finally, to place it where the lily was. It seems like it worked. You don't seem very impressed. I suppose with everything that's happened so far, this is just another puzzle. A puzzle, huh? The door is open. A white light is coming through. Go through the door? Yes. Well, this is it. So, uh, see you on the other side? Yeah! See ya. The end. Reach the true ending. There's. St I, I think I need to do a few replays of this game though. I might need to do like a replay of this. Oh, I'm back! I forgot about this. <gasps> right, how's things back there, cat? Oh my god, wait. You've been giving our merchandise away for free again, haven't you? Man, what the hell am I gonna do with, with you? Right, her name was Cat, I completely forgot. I can't do this to me, man. I <laughs> can't leave you on such a cliffhanger. Fuck. Chapter 2. God damn it. Release it, damn it. Uh, I guess. No, from the devs. Thanks for. Uh...
Still two idiots making this game, yep. Wait. Okay, there's no chapter two. <laughs> Alright. Uh, I might have to do a few replays of this. Just cause... There are a few things I missed, I'm pretty sure. <laughs>